don't play with expansions most of the time anyway, with very specific exceptions. This is in general. I'm perfectly happy to play with one for trying it out, though. But it, this is on, based on your recommendation on which one is actually best. Yeah. Probably Pegasus, then. Fair enough. It's fine. We've compromised. We've now got some expansions. <laughs> okay. Uh, you're the one who knows about these, so what are we doing here? Place agenda with motives, and that's it. Fair enough. Okay. We are currently playing with six, so six it is. Ready, players? Mm -hmm. yep. Why am I at the bottom? Don't know. All right. So Talon has been randomly selected as a starting player. Um, usual rules, I imagine, for picking peoples. Um, what do the silent leaders do for this? They count as a Cylon player, but they have a chance to turn human. Okay. Well, Talon, we're going to leave things to you for the moment. I think it's the same rules as last time. You can pick from any of... You've got to pick from the majority group. and Or you can All pick right. a support character. Um, an engineer. Also, just recommend don't any none of you guys pick the Cylon leaders just because confused. to be it for fun. <laughs> I was okay. thinking that. <laughs> we we okay. know how this is. Since I don't know I'll what's go going on, should time. I just pick anyone? Uh, Tom, Tom, Tom Derek. Tom's got to pick first because he's um, first. So he's yes. going for Tom Derek. I like him last time. Debbie. So you you must now pick a character from either the military leaders, the pilots, or the support characters. Each of them has a set number of cards, a special ability, and a drawback, and a once per game action. So, Tom Zarek is, is the one that, um... He's the one... You used this one last time, actually. So, again, activates administration or the brig action. You may choose to increase or decrease difficulty by two. Uh, once per game, he can lose a population to gain any resource. And he may not activate occupations that are occupied by other characters, with the exception of the brig. Ready to zoom in on these? Uh, alt. Yes. Alt, but again, you need to pick the green line or the red line or the blue line. The alt? Oh, okay. Alt. Yeah, holding alt will um, make the thing bigger for you. Need to pick which color lines? Uh, the the green line. Except the top. Yeah, ignore the one. Ignore the fruit at the top. You need to pick from one of the others. Okay. So William Adama is basically the uh, military leader, more chance of becoming the admiral, having control of the nukes. Um, in fact, all the military leaders. One of well, there is an order, but obviously it'll tell depend that automatically and I don't have the list available but it'll be one of the military leaders that's going to have control of the nukes and things the pilots are more just sort of a general go out there and shoot Cylons with additional tricks and things going on these two at the bottom you can also pick one of the two engineers at the bottom if you want so sport classes are basically they get access to engineering, which is more preparing the ship. Um, I think in general their abilities are less powerful, but still useful. Mm. Of course, what you pick determines what I'm going for. So um, just up to you on this. I think I might go boomer. Fair enough. Okay, so just select the no, select the t thing at the top. This is a script. So if you select the button just above it, select click. The white name. Just like click on the title. I yeah. see. Yeah. There you go. Okay. So that has that. So you're you have recon. So at the end of your turn, you may look at the top card of the crisis deck and place it top or bottom. We'll explain the crisis deck as it goes on. Uh, once per game, before resolving a skill check, you can choose the result, pass or fail, instead of resolving it normally. So you've got one automatic success or failure coming on there. You are, however, a sleeper agent, so you will draw two loyalty cards instead of one during the sleeper agent phase and will be moved to the brig. So you are more likely to be a Cylon agent. So in my case, I've now got to pick a military leader or I've got to pick a support character. And I picked William Adama last time. I'm probably going to go for somebody else just on that basis. Um... And if I pick a military leader, that gives um, Aegon full reign of what he wants to pick. So I'm probably going to do that anyway. 
I, I like the possibility of making myself the present admiral because that was clearly not a powerful situation that Kyrill got himself into last time. So I'm going to take Sol. <laughs> I like mine. I can help get myself the uh, presidency if I want to. It makes it a little bit easier for me. <laughs> okay, so Aegon has free reign. Uh, yeah, that was me last time. Yeah, I'm, I'm deliberately picking characters I didn't pick last time. <laughs> Obviously, people are free to do what they want. What do we think about toasters and kittens? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay, clearly then, if if toasters are associated with kittens, Yebi is clearly a Cylon. <laughs> Uh... Yeah, let's go with Baltar. Okay, so <laughs> Egan has the ability to outright find out if somebody's Cylon, but also is more likely to be a Cylon himself. Perfect. Alright, well, where, where do I pick from? So, Chip, you have a choice of pilot, military, leader, or um, support. Okay. I wouldn't recommend getting a second pilot. You would or wouldn't? I would. Yeah, they, they're they kind of useful. However, obviously, Rise could always take that if you don't, so don't force yourself. He might be trying to do shenanigans even before we know if any of us are Cylons or not. <laughs> um, I have just enough uh, pre uh, presidential groups here. I think I'm gonna, I think I'm going to take this murder lady. Oh, Murder lady fun. seems fine. Okay, so uh, when Admiral's Courses check is passed by 10 or more, you may execute that character instead of 10 to the brick. <laughs> Got it. Uh, <laughs> if it's at six or less distance, draw two civilian ships and destroy them to immediately jump the fleet. Okay, that's good to know. May not activate FTL or engine room. Got it. Uh, just because I didn't go over Gaia, so whenever we draw a crisis card, he gets one skill of his choice, but obviously he only has five cards in his hand. Uh, four after, cards. I, after I draw a crisis card. Yeah, so basically you will draw one card that will always be useful on your turn, and once per, once per game you may look at the all Lord's cards belonging to one player. I would suggest doing that after we've had the refresh. Yeah. Uh, four, but... Okay, so Rise now has the choice of pilot, or he has the choice of support. Or Asylum Leader. If you want to go Cylon Leader, you can go Cylon Leader, but we don't trust you in any case to do the right thing. Right, so he's decided he wants to be Cylon Leader. Fine. I have no idea of how that works, honestly. Nope, he hasn't explained that and isn't going to until it becomes relevant, I'm sure. So, uh, I'm just going to quickly build Destiny deck because that is needed. Also, that now has 12 cards because we now have a Treachery deck to worry about. Fun. Okay. So... What else do we need to do with the start of game? We need to do the loyalty deck shenanigans at this point. I believe. It's pre-built. It should be pre-built, so I'm just going to shuffle it up. I'm going to deal one to each character, then Aegon needs to draw another one. Don't deal. Don't deal? Don't deal because I'm not supposed to be getting goods, so... Fair enough. Okay, yeah. keep keep that um, somewhere safe and relevant. And I meant to actually mask that from the stream, but didn't do so. So, huzzah. All right, so this determines okay. at the start of a game whether you are a toaster or not. Uh, so, I think the major changes is treachery deck, which are bad cards. Almost always negative. Mm -hmm. uh, adds the Pegasus board. Yep. Which is just That's poor more locations. And it, when Galactica would take damage, the turn player can instead send that damage to Pegasus. Okay, sure. Uh, more crisis cards, more I think. Crisis cards. Okay, but in terms of everything else kind of fundamental, hasn't not much has changed there. All right, so start of game process then. 
Um, each of us draws cards equal to, well, we draw up to three cards based on our um, current draw set. Obviously, at this point, though, this is just the pre-setup. The only person not doing this is Talon, who is the first player. Now, I click the draw a set. Uh, I think that draws you the full set of cards if you press that. So. Well, it's not the first player. I want to do that. Uh, Talon, Talon will, yeah. So Talon will do that at the start of his turn once he's once we're all ready. Oh, I'm the president. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You Wait, sorry. So I should be just drawing what? Uh, so at this point, we draw three cards from our allowed types. So the, of our choice. You don't do anything yet, Talon. Yeah, Talon doesn't do anything yet because when he starts, right. he draws his full set. But everybody else can draw up to um, draw three cards based on what you've got. So okay, so I can do tactics or leadership. Yeah, so you can cards. only do tactics leadership. I by the what, way, what just... are the what are the difference between those decks? Like, what are those decks? Uh, we will contain? need all we will need all five types. Um, basically, leadership allows a few cards which um, give people double moves. They're especially really useful. Executive orders and type things. Uh, Tactics is a few cards which lowers the difficulty of certain checks. Also has um, some scouts as well, which give us the ability to do things. I've drawn two um, Tactics, one Leadership for the moment, so you might want to do the inverse of me. just for. Alright, that sounds... Of... a feng shui. Indeed. Um, Egan? Uh, yeah. So you got politics, leadership, engineering. Is there a hand size limit? Uh, yes, there is, a t but 10. Debbie, you also need to draw three cards from tactics, piloting, engineering. Probably best to draw one of each at the moment. So the, deck the decks are here. It can draw one politics, one engineering. Sure. So your ability, drink lips the face of guard movement. Draw two cards from the top of the destiny deck, place two cards from your hand on top of the destiny deck. Okay. Once we game, exchange your hand of skill cards with another player's hand of skill cards. Uh, you may not voluntarily move to a location that contains another character. Okay. Where are you starting, actually? Come to that. Oh, you're actually on the side of the ship. Okay. Good to know. Okay. So, with everybody's got their initial hand of cards started, we move to Talon's turn. Alright, I shall draw up my cards. Yep, so if you just click, click, click slick the button on the top left, that will draw you the cards you're supposed to get each turn. Uh, never mind, I think you the right number. Um, and I am, since I'm not the president and I'm not going to try to get it yet, I think, honestly, the best I could do would be getting two more cards, right? I mean, two more cards isn't a bad thing to just have randomly, so fine. Doesn't, yeah, it just doesn't necessarily help. Otherwise, us just to... lose a card moving. Yeah, true. Yes. Yeah, we're okay with that. I would want to steal the quorumness, but I don't think it's the right thing to do yet. <laughs> no, it's clearly a good idea. Yes. If it was Rosalind, I would definitely, because she just is. So I'll just take two cards, and uh, unfortunately, crisis. These are politics, right? Uh, draw. Yep. It looks slightly like this color, treachery color, so I don't want to make a mistake there. <laughs> it's fine. Treachery's on the far left. And, uh, Crisis, right? Yep, so... Yep. Yep, so reveal. Yes. Uh, yeah. Flip. Okay, so the first Crisis of the game. A verdict of guilty. Admiral chooses. Who's the Admiral right now? Helena Kane. Blood. Okay. So, oh, I'm the Admiral, yeah, yeah, yeah. You have a choice. So the current player is executed and the Admiral discards three skill cards. Wow. Or damage to oh, Galactia twice. <laughs> I could really be a murder lady. Um, um, if he's executed, he does get a new character, I believe. But um, Yeah, so how, yeah. Does, how, does, how does executing work? What does that mean, technically mean in the context of the game? In the so of the game, he reveals his loyalty cards. Here. If he has any Salon loyalty cards, he reveals it, he goes to the Resurrection ship, he discards all his cards, and he does not get a Super Crisis. If he has only human loyalty cards, he reveals them all, he discards his hand, we would lose one morale, and he would get a new character. 
Okay, cool. And then as far as lose and win conditions, how are how does the fuel, food, morale, and population? Any of those that? go to zero, we lose at the end of the turn. Okay, I see. And then how many Cylons and how many humans are there? Um, there are, I believe, two Cylon cards in the deck. Uh, and how many two the deck? Were Cylon loyalties. There were ten. You are not a Cylon. And then I'm special. We also Do you have, count uh, as Boomer a Cylon, and, uh, right? Got a Gaius in it too. So he has two more, right? Um, yes. Yeah, so there are. If I am up here, I count as a Cylon. If I'm down here, I count as a human. And who do you win with? That depends on what motives I draw. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Uh, so you have motives that win, determine. The, okay. He, he could, he could condition do is have two cards from the winning team and no more than one unrevealed card. Okay. Cool. So we'll just kill you as soon as possible, and we'll be good. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> we can. Um, we okay, can. I think we'll just damage the Galactica twice, because I don't think I'll to <laughs> someone on the first turn of the game. Oh, come yeah, on. I mean, fine. fine. All right, so... Challenge so... gets to choose what ship you damage. Do you want to damage Pegasus or Galactica? Well, I'm on Pegasus, so I feel like... Uh, it does say Galactica, so... Yeah. Um, yeah. I think it'll have to be Galactica. I'm not sure. I've never, I've never played with executions before, so... That's fine. So basically, the way damage works is basically we have certain rooms that we cannot use at that point. Um, okay. I, but, um, okay, so we're going to go Galactica damage. There's Galactica damage one, one and Galactica damage two. Do the honors, please. All right. We've lost the armory. That's not too bad. And the hangar bay. That's actually oh. terrible. Oh, God. I'm going to have to play mechanic, aren't I? Uh, I mean, I think Debbie's going to have to play Mechanic because she's the only one with any engineering cards. And so I, I have guess engineering. You. Oh, yeah. Uh, we also move up at least the uh, she's jump also... party. Yep. So jump moves up and one. And we get shot at. And we do, in fact, get shot at. So uh, I need to get the tables back up. Actually, that would be kind of useful. Where are the things that are shooting us? Uh, uh, well, at yeah. this point, it's assumed it's the base star. Oh, okay. Uh, so, do, let's hope it's low. No, nope. it's not low. <laughs> it's a six. Same I mean, dice as before. I mean, I if, you, if you look on the scale of eternity, it's quite low. Oh, absolutely. It's true. Yeah, sure. Okay. Uh, FPL control got hit. We need a lot of repairing. Yeah. Let's see how <sighs> So um, yeah, this is um, this is a start. Is my mic not working? No, it's working. But uh, no, it is. I ask, so, can I play a evasive maneuvers card to no. roll damage, no. or should I? I think that's a pile of yeah, from the Galactica rather than the Galactica at this point. But I don't think that's a ship as large it. as that can do evasive maneuvers. <laughs> I'd, we'd have to have a look at the cards specifically, but I don't think that works the way you think it does. I think that's more for Viper um, things. Vipers only. Hmm. But the good news is... Sorry, I didn't catch that. Are we getting shot at by? Well, the base star, officially. <laughs> okay, so can anything be done about that? Not right no. now. Not right now. I mean, killing the base star would help. <laughs> which might be what we end up trying to do in the next few turns. Nevertheless, um, the turn... Shadow's turn, I think. Nope, it's Debbie's turn. Debbie's so, those in... Uh... No, that was Talon oh. to start with, so... Alright, so Debbie, start of your turn. If you press the button in the oh, upper left sorry. for draw set, that will draw your cards for the turn. I don't, because you're in sick bay. Oh, actually, no, that is correct. You're in sick bay. So you get one skill card of your choice from your normal set. So either one tactics, one piloting, or one engineering. Cop engineering, cop, cop. Uh, probably. Okay, so I draw one. Yep. Right, you then get one movement. You want to move yourself out of sick bay because starting in sick bay causes you to um, be sick and therefore not get all your cards each turn. So you can move to any location on the Galactica with no cost. You can move, discard one card to move onto the Pegasus or the um, is that what is that ship actually? It's the command one, isn't it? Colonial so, one. Colonial one. Yeah. Did the control room get damaged with, with it, or is that not damaged? 
Uh, FTL control did. Communications is a different area oh. at this point. So we'll How just... did FTL control get damaged, though? I missed. That, that was oh, the, base, the base star got an attack at the end of the card, so oh, we, got, okay. we, got, shot, we that... got shot at again. <laughs> and we got hit, so we damage another room, I see. Yep. Okay. Slowly learning this game. That's fine. <laughs> so you get one move and one action. The action can either be the action that's on the um, space you're moving to, or it can be an action card that is in your hand that takes one action. Okay. So, for example, if you have a repair card, it's probably a good idea to go to one of the damaged locations and repair it. Probably prioritizing the hangar followed by FTL control at this point, but... The hangar is one of the damaged locations? Yeah, so the hangar is the one that allows us to launch ships to try and deal with some of this. Well, specifically you to launch yourself. True. And you are the pilot, so it's in your best interest to get that sorted at some point. Okay, so that's your move. Um, you can now play one action, which is presumably a repair card from your hand. Okay. Assuming you have some, because the engineering deck is not all repairs, after all. I've got repairs. No, okay, that's good. I'll put cards. Just, just place it in front. Show, show the card. Okay, so repair your current location, or if you're in the hangar deck, you may repair two damaged vipers. So what happens from that is that gets removed and will go back into the pile, which will get shuffled. This goes into the discards. Right, so that's your one move, one action. Next, we resolve a crisis. So you basically flip the top card of the crisis deck, and we see what happens. supposed to flip it um okay i'll flip it for you fine um yeah the deck's up here so uh, I, I didn't know who's supposed to flip it <laughs> well anybody but i was assessing you doing it because it was your turn <laughs> that's um okay oh. fine I, i've done it now all right so it is colonial day so first things first i press the destiny button because this is going to be a skill check so two random cards I mean, added to this pile. choose if it's a skill check or not oh actually there's a point so you may look at so basically the way this works, Debbie, with your character ability is you look at this top card and determine whether we want to use this check or whether we use the next check in sequence. And this goes oh. on the bottom. This one's probably fine because we've got Well no. So she gets to do choose to do the skill check of if we pass we get plus one well, or if we fail it's minus two, or she can just take up the minus one right now. Oh I see. With no skill. And then the skill tricks, are we just discarding cards from our hand that equal the colors on the left side of the card to yep. try and get so, to the number? Yep, okay. absolutely. If we dis if we discard into the pile, and I think this is a weird way it does it, uh, but basically we will add cards to the pile. Any card of those colors is positive. Any card that is not those colors is negative. And there'll be a total result okay. at the end. And why are there two in there already? Because the Destiny deck. So basically there are always going to be two randoms. This is drawn from a pile oh, of two of, okay. each of, the, of each of the decks, basically. So that's to okay. mitigate um, somebody being sneaky. The one rule Sweet. that is kind of a rule with this, we're not allowed to state outright how good the cards we're putting in are, because it's right. too easy to get there. We can give generalizations or say we don't have a lot of help with this. But um... Right. All right. Um, so what's the point of doing a skill check? We get one well, more Well, we get a good effect rather than a bad effect. Um, but obviously, this is, if we believe this is one we can do, then there's no reason to go and check the next one. Um, but this is this is your character ability, I'm, I'm thinking of, rather than... Actually, no, Recon's for next turn. Don't worry about that. So here, we just have a choice of either trying it, and if we fail, we get minus two morale, or we can take the one morale hit now and just not do a check. I guess we'll do them the check. Okay, fine. So, um... So, Debbie, <laughs> the start check button... Debbie. Debbie. You. There you go. So what that'll do is that will then put a card in front of me. Unfortunately, I don't have a lot that's good, so I'm, I'm not adding a lot of value to this one. Um, I 
Make sure you put your cards face down on the board, Chip. Oh, okay. So I just add cards for. So we are doing the skill check. Yeah, we are. So either politics yes. or. Um... So purple and yellow add to it, and everything else anything is negative. Else, anything else reduces from it. Do you have to put a card in? You do not. If you do not no. have, you are under no obligation to put a card in. If you have nothing that helpful, or you want to save your cards for later, that's fine. You just press done, and then it passes on to rise. And what is the range of uh, numbers one, on one, the card? One to five is the five is the absolute and top that level. Doesn't necessarily correspond to the like how good the card is, correct? No. If from what I can sort of gather from a deck, most of them have a one to five of each type of card, so. Okay, so it's basically just I'm evaluating based on whether my and can you do you guys know what color cards I have? That's not. Uh, that... Well, we know what cards you've got in your sheet, so I know you've drawn tactics and leadership. Right, so you know I have purple cards, but yeah, you don't however, have many. Yeah, however, obviously, cards if it's not very, I only don't have any, I only put one in, and it's not a very high one, so we probably need a bit of help. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but that, I... be, that being said, if you can't do it, then and you've got a useful card, save it for later. Yeah, this card is extremely useful, so I feel like I should pass. Fair enough. <laughs> Is so I just the, hit pass button? You hit pass. This isn't the end of the world if we fail this, because we've got 10 morale to play with, but obviously it's um, it's a thing. Right. So Talon should have a bunch... Talon drew two political cards. He's got to have something that helps. Right? I can help a fair amount. I can't uh, not do it all myself. I can can you put any number in? Cards. Oh yeah, you can put any number of cards in. You can put your entire hand okay. in if you really want to. But, um... okay. but then you're losing... And then how do you draw cards back? At the beginning of you, your turn, you, you just draw up to your yeah, total? Yeah, you draw the... The cards you've got indicated on your um, character sheet, you draw at the start of your turn. So obviously we oh, do okay. need to keep some things in reserve for um, future checks. Okay, but you do like get a lot of cards on your turn generally. Well, five. So. <laughs> like, yeah, which I guess maybe isn't a lot. I don't know. <laughs> Half oh, of the well. max isn't bad. <laughs> if, if we use one card each turn, we're going to have a turn where we can't do anything. That's, that's, that's kind fair. Of that's the math on it. All right. So Shadow, just correcting something. The more common cards are generally strength one to two. The rare cards oh, okay. are strength. Uh, I, 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 as I say, this is me just sort of randomly judging from the last game, but it did seem as if it was one of the five on most of them. But that's fine. Thanks for the clarification. Wait, what was that? Sorry. So the, it, the uh, more common cards are strength one and two. The more rare cards are strength three, four, and five. Okay, so higher numbers do occasional do sometimes mean something. <laughs> Uh, you're right, Tal. Okay. Uh, didn't didn't uh, pop up. Oh, all right. Uh, just drop it onto the. Yeah, you just literally put it on there, and then when you pop yeah, it the that, onto the bo oh. onto the box. Oh, onto the box. All right. Yeah, the box is in front I of you. Have a... And done, I guess. All right. Okay. If you done, you think that's fine. All right. It's a then... good good card. So hopefully, be enough. And Debbie. So basically, if you have got one available, it's going to be useful. You can add a. Um, yellow or purple to this to help us out, or you can try and save your cards for later. Um, I do have a purple, but it's I don't know if it's a waste of it or not to use it for this. If you're unsure, it's probably worth keeping it, um, especially as an action that yeah. you can perform later. Yeah. All right. All right, then just click the button to say done. If that'll pass. Which button? There's a button in front of you. My cards are covering it up. Sorry. Sorry. Okay, so we then lay out and we have a check of one. Uh, uh, nine, wow. 13, 14, minus two. So we actually pass that check. Wait, yeah. minus four. Oh. Minus six. Oh, oh that's right? great. Yeah, no, no, that's absolutely fine. Yeah, minus six. So ten minus six, so four. Yeah. So we actually failed that. It's minus two wow. morale. Well, that was well, I had trust tree, right? That's had to be from the De Destiny deck. Yeah, two cards were randomly from a Destiny deck. However, somebody could have, and nobody could have put in a trick. Oh, actually, I didn't realize it was that's a what I filter. Yeah, so the, the that one had to come from a trick deck because Rise didn't add anything. I did check that specifically. But someone could have added a green card, right? Somebody so could have added that green card. Absolutely. Yes. However, we know who's got green cards. Tom also, Zarek, I didn't add a card, myself. so I'm actually, safe. Actually, all, all four, <laughs> four of us have green cards, yes. so yeah. But I didn't put any in, so couldn't have been me. <laughs> Absolutely, the suspicion begins. So if Debbie's done with her turn, it then... So Debbie, draw the dice. You're trying to get three or less. Oh yeah, actually, I forgot about that. So yes. Uh, roll the dice because we have a, um, another attack from the base star. 
Where is there like a, a reference for what that attack looks like somewhere on the board or something, or is it just in the rules? Uh, well, the last version of this I had had the oh there we go. The, where'd you get? Oh, you have the quick reference cards available. Ah, awesome, beautiful. It's fine. I didn't see them earlier. That's the we're on the attack table, right? Yep. And every roll to five. Yep. Oh, I see. Activating silence. Shift. So she did actually. We damaged the galactic again. Have you shuffled the tokens? Yes, okay. but don't be confused if it's Pegasus or Galactica. Oh, I forgot to buy cereal. <gasps> but Debbie, what's getting damaged? Pegasus Galactica. Why? Do, what's the difference between damaging them? Uh, basically, it's, besides it's the, that they're the, different the, places, they're different places with different abilities. Ultimately. Okay, but if they all count Pegasus together for our lose zero. condition of like six damaged places, or how yeah. does that how does that work? It's if Pe Galactica specifically has six damaged tokens on it. Okay, so the Pegasus is just like somewhere we can do extra damage to and be safer. Yeah, it's although there's commonly quite some, there's called some good Battle Shield Pegasus. Well, what was that, Rice? Commonly called Battle Shield Pegasus. Ah, okay. Debbie? Debbie? Uh, Would you are, like to damage yeah. the Galactica or the Pegasus? Oh. Uh, what are we on? <laughs> Both, technically. We... I'm the only I'm on the Pegasus. Everyone else is on the other one. Which also mm. means there's nobody available who can repair it without discarding a card to get over there. True. I have a repair card. Yeah, but you'd have to go over there, so... Do I have to damage one or the other? Yes, because you can yes. damage. Uh, I guess the one that's not Pegasus. <laughs> What's okay. it called? Go ahead, Alright, and the Admiral's quarters have been done, so nobody's going to get thrown to the brig. What? But then I can't murder anyone. In fairness, we can just throw them in the airlock. <laughs> that's you true. Could have, you could have murdered somebody last turn. That's true, and I didn't, so I've already I've already violated my... Uh, <laughs> Alright, my, my turn. One and indeed, we are now up to... We're nearly at the point where we can get out of here, maybe. So when we jump, what happens when we jump? Uh, basically, we new... the, sh the ships are removed, we basically restart. Does all of our damage remove as well? No, no. unfortunately not. If we're boarded as well, the, the troops remain as well, so... Okay, cool. Okay. Um... You press and turn at the top of the screen. Okay, so I am going to... Okay. And with action cards, you can only play those on your turn, right? Yes, I believe so. Or somebody else executive orders you. Yeah, and there's ways I can do that, and I'm probably going to executive order somebody here if I can work this out. Okay, I see. Um, because I know Debbie's got... Debbie, did you say you have another repair? Yeah. Okay, good. Then I'm going to be executing oh. ordering you here. I'm just trying to watch the sequence yeah. things. Okay, so um, as my movement, I'm going to go critical situation. So as my movement, I will take one action, which is just going to... Note, yeah. You can only take like, critical situation or executive or, order. Yeah. Oh, okay. Then I'm probably not going to do that because I'm still probably going to activate Vipers on my turn. Um, because ultimately we could probably do with a few getting around there and doing some stuff. Or I could go weapon control and try to damage the base star. But I feel... I mean, throwing vapors at the raiders is good. Let them get destroyed. Yeah, fine. Alright, so I'm gonna act I'm gonna activate command from where I am without moving. Although, except... No, I can't do that, because obviously that's for executive order Debbie. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I have, I have decisions, but I can't do both. So I feel what I'm going to do then, rather than get repairs doing for the moment, I am going to actually just activate the Vipers where I currently am. So, new Viper on the board, and we're going to move one Viper across. So, sorry, which expansion are we playing with? Just because I'm looking at the rules. Pegasus. Pegasus. Right. That's the only expansion we're playing with? Yeah. Okay. So the good news about doing this is while we haven't actually attacked them at all, it does mean they will have to try and kill this Viper first. Unfortunately, if we, if we were playing with the other pilot, then we'd have um, somebody actually in there to, you know, sacrifice. <laughs> okay, so that's um, movement action done. Crisis. 
Good news! Terrorist investigations! So, political and leadership. And current player looks at one random loyalty card belonging to any player. So I can get some information about whether somebody is a silent oh, nice. at the moment. If we pass this. If, nice. if it's six, on a 6+, plus, there's no effect. And if we fail the check without going above 6, then that we lose the morale. We lose the morale. Okay. Um, one more question. What? How do civilian ships? What are civilian ships, and how do they affect anything? Basically, they have, they have supplies. If the um, if they get killed by raiders, um, we lose those supplies. And when do we get the civilian ships? Oh, they just appear on. They're, they're basically whenever we draw a card from the crisis deck, which has a map, it'll show how uh -huh. the current new silent wave has come and wherever civilian ships happen to be at the point they attack. I see. So okay. new ones get spawned as and when we encounter additional raids. Because in theory, and in the sort of canon of what's going on, we're at the moment trying to gather all the civilian ships to, safe, to a safe, close location before we jump. This is just where, as the base star and free raiders have come in, our ships are currently positioned. I see. Okay, cool. Yeah, because my action is destroy, draw two civilian ships and destroy them to immediately jump the fleet. And I was just wondering why that was bad. Yeah, now I get it. It. We, we do lose resources. <laughs> all right, okay. so Destiny and start the check so Agen is the first player to start adding cards to it um mm -hmm. just as an fyi um this is a check i've got i've got a few cards i can add to this i prefer not to add my high value one but if i need to i can adjust it from there that's a high number unfortunately though that's... you at least want to get the six plus yeah that that's that's doable i don't think you should try for the uh 12 though that's a lot of cards i believe it's card poor that sounds like something a traitor would say to prevent me from getting uh, this. This is my turn? Oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah. cards are pretty. Uh, you should also fit them. Basically, so I don't see them. Yeah. Let's see. Wait, and what are the yeah, good colors? Yellow and green. Yellow yeah, so, and green. Yeah, so you do have some greens, but. Cool. Obviously, I can throw one in there. Yep. Yeah. So currently we have four cards currently in. Need to add a card? Uh, not yet. It's currently talents to add cards. Uh, he does I have some one. leadership. Okay, he's adding one. He's hedging bets. He doesn't want me to accuse him and find out. I get it. Press the button. I don't think this is a worth going crazy for. Says the person who's a Cylon. <laughs> so Debbie, this is a green, this is a green yellow check. If you have nothing, just pass the thing on. Yeah, I don't have any green or yellow. Yep. It's the antithesis of your guys. It, it is. So just pass it on. All right. Um, I'm gonna add two cards. Okay. Lay them out. I think this is seven, eight, nine. Uh, 13. So we got the plus 6. Because somebody put some purple cards in. Well, good mean Destiny. Yes, I believe that. <laughs> okay, return. Uh, return cards? Was that? Return. Yep. Who has purple cards? Yeah, so oh, we got, we got, we got, we got, right. okay. we got We got to plus 6, so no effect. Um, we then go and add a heavy raid to the board, which um, has already been done. And we are now at the point where we could, in theory, FTL control if FTL was working. Just as a question for Rise, that doesn't prevent us from jumping at all at auto jump, does it? You still auto jump. Okay, that's that's all I need to check before anything else. So, so agents, we need two more turns before we auto jump, though, right? Well, assuming two, two cans where we reveal in the bottom right um, cards with that symbol. Not all the cards have that. Oh, I see. So we're just getting lucky. <laughs> yeah, we're just getting lucky at the moment. <laughs> Great. Okay. So, and we have to jump eight times? We kind of. The Admiral determines which location we go to, um, uh -huh. and we have to jump a total of eight points and then jump one more time. Now, there's okay, the, where vari the, the various destination cards have one, two, or three. The ones uh -huh. are generally safer. We lose less resources for going for that. The threes normally put us into terrible positions. Let's say we were I immediately see. ambushed, but it's basically okay. a balancing act of those. Anyway, I see. Egan, draw your set. El Presidente. Okay. But I'm going to remember that you all prevented me from uh, finding things out. <laughs> Solve will remember this. Okay. 
Hmm. Oh, I don't think it applied to me, but if I ever have just one card in my hand at the start of somebody's turn, I have to discard it. Yeah. All right. Now I could either go repair something, uh, or I could go get quorum cards. It might be worth you going and getting quorum cards, in all honesty, because yes. we might be we need FTL control repaired, but I think we might be able to wait on that. Um, repairs does say current location, though, so we would need somebody to move to there um, at some point to do that. Yeah. Well, how much health does the base star have? I mean, three points, but there's a d one of the damage markers counts for double. Okay. And as we damage so it, it loses the ability to do things. So it's currently undamaged, though, right? It's currently undamaged, so yeah. I, I would like to get to weapons control and blast it, but I felt... Right, because well, to... on my turn, I can damage it, too. Like, I have the Pegasus CIC, so that's why I was... Thinking. Yeah, absolutely. I think I've got to go to President's office. That means discarding a card, right? Yep. If you're a president, mm -hmm. you draw a quorum card. Oh, nice. So right. you should start the game with one quorum card in your hand. Okay. So oh, draw I, one I anyway. didn't. I need to draw two then. Yep. You may then either play one of the quorum cards or draw an extra one. I'll draw an extra one. We got another president who's a Cylon. Flying my strategy from last time, apparently. <laughs> I refuse to believe you don't have useful things you can do right now, sir. Alright, let's see. Well, it says Jesus. Hold on. Oh, I meant, no, I meant the crisis since you've now done the oh. move, basically. So he didn't. Wait, did he do nothing? Well, he, he basically drew quorum cards, so. Yes. He, yeah, he, he just drew he, cards. Yeah, so he's got three quorum cards for later. <laughs> Computer jump failure. Okay. So this is going to cause us to go backwards a bit. Mm, and lose population. Okay. The good news is... I can't help it all. all purple and blue. All of us have purple, pretty much. Yeah. But this is the same purple card that I did not want to discard last time, so... Fair enough. So, before anything else, you get to draw a card of any color, Aiken. Oh, yeah, yep. yeah, yeah, yeah. This is your effect, so... We'll find out whether you do something treasonous here. You did draw You did draw one card that's going to be useful. Fine. <laughs> yeah. Start to and press start check. Start check. Uh, yeah, like, I'm going to pass because I don't want to... This card's really good. Or it appears really good, but I don't really know since I haven't played before. <laughs> I think it's really good. All right. <laughs> I can't do anything, obviously. So, Debbie, this is a purple or blue check. I would save your repair cards, though. Uh, okay. Doing another check. <laughs> yeah, we do a check every turn, pretty much. So this is a purple blue check. We only need seven. But the fact that there's no cards have gone in there yet means it's a bit worrying. <laughs> <laughs> but uh. if you don't have anything, then uh, put it in the, on the box. Oh, dear. Where? Oh, here. Yeah, on the black box in front of you. Yeah. It's in your hand by the look of it. Oh, face down? Yeah, face down, yeah. just in the black box, and then press down. Uh, Aegon. Yes? Given we have basically three cards here, and I do have a five in my hand, I've done it, no, ignore that. <laughs> you do have a large card in your hand. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> That's fine. I, le I leave speaking and plotting rights. <laughs> <laughs> That's purple and blue, right? Purple and blue, but I would save your blues if you can. <laughs> Not that you can do a lot. Uh, I have, I have a few. All right, lay out. <laughs> Six. And uh, six. Four. Nine. nine ten, ten. Twelve. Twelve minus six. So six. Because, we lose population. Wow. We are so close. 
if anybody has a card that reduces the difficulty, now would be the time to play it. Um, I do not. My, mine are, would my, you? They'd have to be played before, and it's actually a die, res, die roll. I don't have an ability to change that. What are we looking for? Anything that would increase the yeah, roll, but... Uh... I have any Wouldn't have it. It's a green. And a repair. Yeah, I yep. don't have any greens left, so that is a failed check. Yep. Okay, so return cards. Okay, so we lose one population. Our jump preparation goes back one step. And also, the raider produces some more raid. Uh, the base star produces more raiders. So that's fun. <laughs> okay, if I take a quick AFK, I have to feed hungry cats before they get destructive. <laughs> yep, fair enough. Um, okay, I'll just be a minute. All right, over to the black cat. Cat. Of a drink. Um. Come along, Lucy. All right. So first, I can. Oh, you just said. Draw my set. So is there a button? Yeah, yeah. there's a draw, draw set. Yours is slightly modified because you obviously get one um, of an option. You get to choose an extra tactics or an extra leadership. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Okay. Same I thing. will take... Let me just look really quick at what these do. Mm -hmm. So, sorry. These rafters and vipers, how do they work? Uh, so vipers we have to basically deploy and use via the command thing so basically that activate means you can move one um activate one move one into one of the two starting zones or attack with one uh -huh. pilots have a bit more control over this because when they're piloting they get a free action with um, one of their vipers they also have okay. the ability to use cards to attack with the problem is of course we got debbie currently using doing repairs rather than going out there and you know being a hanger so she's probably going to be there for the next round it might even be an idea next time to give an executive action to her to allow her to fly out there uh -huh. but um again the main problem is of course if we're dealing with the base stuff you deal with the base stuff then a lot of the um a lot of the troops stop appearing but in the meantime we just have to attack them it's they're really easy to kill the raiders it's only a three to eight but they work I in a sort of we have to deploy vipers and then what about raptors same thing uh, raptors are slightly different so raptors are sort of our scout ships and specific um leash tactics cards say what that happens with those mostly they just go up well, we risk them to try and do things okay you basically I have them on a dive roll i see and we just have a limited number of them to do to risk yeah. with we only have four raptors basically i see okay cool and then how far can i move just one space uh you can move, yeah, you move within the same location ship. you can move within the same ship okay. for free you can discard a card and move to any other ship um anywhere on any other ship yeah if you discard a card but um, yep. other than that it's just okay. on this so I think I probably will just do, and I can. Sorry, is there an order I have to do my actions in, or can I do an act? Uh, can I movement step, okay. action step, crisis step? Okay, so. cool. So I'm not gonna move. I'm just gonna stay here, um, and then oh, it's activate the location or use a card, not both. Yeah, pretty much. So okay, well I'm gonna activate the location and do a base star attack. Okay, so roll the dice. Uh, bye, rise. Bye. Bye, Raz. Where's the dice? Uh, it's right by you, actually. Aha. Three. You've successfully damaged the Pegasus. Woo! That did not work. Yep, flip. And... Okay. You damaged the... Well, Alright, we have no ability to... We have no ability to murder people. That's unfortunate. Okay. So now, uh, crisis step. Yep, flip the crisis yep. deck over and we'll find out what's going on. Good news, everybody! We're surrounded! Oh, God. So, this um, basically spawns everything that's on there, but first of all, we do the activation. So, the base star attacks, if you would roll for that. Oh, God. Okay. This, this is going to be a quick game, isn't it? No, no, no. We, can, we basically have to get out of here. Three. All right, the good news is the base star um, failed to damage us this round. Woo! I Bad news is okay. now we deploy everything else. So we have a second base star. We have an extra four raiders in this quadrant. 
Oh, okay, I see how this is working. We have an extra civilian ship in each of these. Uh, we have an extra whatever that ship is in the bottom too. Yep, a heavy radar, and we have a Viper each. Okay. okay. Woo! Getting out of here soon is looking advisable. I can use my ability to blind jump us. <laughs> That'd be a... It might That's, be it's, good it's, at this it's, point. It's an action. Usually, you want to use it early. But... It would have to be on my next turn, unfortunately. It'll have to be on so your next you turn. Had, you had five turns. Wait. Yeah. Wait, just a moment. Uh, could some XO you to allow you to do it? Oh yeah, that's true. Someone could executive action me. Do we have to be in the even if we just have to be six or less distance? <laughs> yeah. The admiral will only draw one destination card, but it might just get us out of this mess. The problem is, of course, yeah. we've got Rise's turn next, so you know, what are the chances he's going to help us out? <laughs> Yep. Sadly, I need you to at least get to sleeper phase, so... <laughs> I don't know about that. We might not make it. What's sleeper, what's sleeper phase? phase? When we've moved four, basically we redraw from a loyalty deck and more people become silence. If they oh, aren't already. Okay. Although okay, it does lead to the great. occasional situation where you become a silent twice. I see. Then you're really evil. Yeah, but there's a, you also know there's only one of you, so... <laughs> yes. Well, initially one of you. There's ways of getting more. <laughs> right. Okay, well, so, oh, and then I end my turn. That's the end, right? Yeah, yeah, that's the end of your turn. Oh, and then I have to discard three cards, right? Is that what this says? Yep. Oh, yeah, the current player discards three, yeah. Absolutely. Fantastic, that's great. Love that. Is there an easy way to discard, or do I just drag it in? I uh, just drag. I'm just going to we'll just throw them into the piles. Just fade. Okay. So, like that? Yeah. One. Uh... Two. For my choice, I'm drawing engineer. And mm, toast. So I'm not paying much attention to chat because this is game game has gone um, interestingly at the start. Three. No, actually, just JK. <laughs> uh, three. I'll discard this. All right. Okay. <laughs> All right, well. Rise. It seems I need to come help you, fleshy humans. <laughs> what are you talking about? We we got this. Oh. Absolutely nothing is going wrong whatsoever. It's the face of God. There we go, that's what I'm looking for. Infiltrating Galactica. What is that? So basically he's got um he's got a list of cards he can do from here. But he's treated as a human player in all respects except for he draws extra. He can only play two cards in a skill checks and he can't become Admiral or President. Okay. Indeed. But what is he going to do with his um, infiltration, then? And then you have two <laughs> motive cards, and what do the motive cards look like? They, like, give you ideas of what you they should give be doing. Me, they give me a condition that I need to fulfill to reveal them at the end of the game. <laughs> okay. And I have to have either... I have to have two from the winning team revealed, and then more than un one unrevealed card. Okay, cool. So... For example, there are some cards that need some resources above a certain value, some that need them below a certain value. I see. Okay. looking good right now. <laughs> hey, he's back. No worries, Ryze is just I'll, doing his traits turn. I'll take and infiltrate to the research lab. And it is now a crisis. Hooray! Admiral chooses. <laughs> well then, Admiral, um, make your decision. Lose a two core, lose a ball and two cards from your hand.
The Admiral. The Admiral is um Pain. I'm I'm the Admiral. Yeah. He's deciding. Wait, oh, what do I need to decide? Sorry. Do we lose a new literally... or do we lose <laughs> do you lose two skill cards and a morale? Discard one new to oh. <laughs> um I mean, what do you guys think? Personally, I'd rather take the morale hit and have the availability of weapons later. And make me lose even more skill cards? Absolutely. Considering we don't even gain anything by discarding a nuke. Well, the nuke's fine. That's true. Nuke's fine in basis, but we're high enough on morale that we could take the hit. It's whether you think... Um, it's and we only have choice. two nukes, right? We only have two oh, nukes. Oh, yeah, we, and there's no way to get a new one as far as I'm aware. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll discard. That's fine. Lose morale. Okay. Heavy Raiders then activate, so... Um... Unfortunately, I have really good cards, so that's kind of sad, but it's all right. Goodbye, really good card number one. <laughs> Four. Oh, boy. Damn, I guess we'll get rid of this, too. All right. All right. Uh, excuse me while I try to not fall off my chair. Yes, we all always excuse you while you try not to fall off your chair, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Should be a daily goal for you, Aiden. It is a, it is a good goal. All right. Um, Talon, save us. <laughs> I actually might. Good. <laughs> Try your kids. Alright, I guess I thought it would I draw a set. Yep. Alright, um. So once you hit your max, do you discard at the end of your turn, I'm assuming? You discard down yes. to 10 at the end of the turn. Well, okay. um, Admiral, will you jump? At the end of, at the end of any of these turns, just the FYI. Okay, Admiral? Yes. Will you get us out the hell out of here if I actually order you? You want me to blind jump? I I think it's a good idea. I think honestly, blind jumping with everything going on give us a chance to try and reset. Yeah, yeah, I can do that. I'm exoing. Uh, the admiral. Okay. If you have a launch scout, you might want to do that first. Got to look at what the top card is. I do not because I just discarded it. <laughs> you did. Well, you have your two actions in your current location, or remove in one action. But ultimately, we want that action to be um, get... your line jump. Oh, okay. <laughs> so there's no reason for me to do the Pegasus CIC because, yeah. Um, yeah, I I don't need two actions. I'll just we'll just do the blind jump. I guess I could do the action after the blind jump. So let's do the blind jump. All right. Prepare for blind jump. So draw two civilian ships and immediately and destroy them. So yeah. how does that work? So basically draw two civilian ships and then we flip them over and we find out what we lose. Okay. Boop. One population and... Immortal souls. Basically these are the ones who didn't make it. Boo. And, and nothing. And nothing. All right. okay. I'm okay with this. That's okay. Yeah. We lost one population for... I feel like a title we could have lost. Absolutely. And okay. where do these go now? Alright. Um, what happens with those rest? They're just removed from the game. Okay, that's fine. Okay. So they're just removed from the game. So we throw them off the table. That just means they're going to appear on the table again after you've done that. I know. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. I don't there's, there's discard boxes there's, in the corner. There's a discard box. Okay, and then and then I have one more action once we jump. Uh, right? Nope, yeah, but first off, you need to draw the top deck, card of the destination deck, and decide which one of the yeah. one card we're going to. Alright. Is this public, or...? Well, in theory not, but you have to reveal where we're going, so... Okay, well, uh, we'll take a look. <laughs> you choose one, oh. but the other is on the bottom. Yep, absolutely. So you choose one of the one cards, and then... I um... thought this was oh. chose one. <laughs> Alright, I choose this card. Alright, so we lose one view. And then I can risk a raptor to roll a die of three or higher, gain two fuel. I mean, yeah, we'll... We're gonna do that. Just don't roll a one. I mean, you know, that's all you gotta do. Don't roll a one. You had you one go. job! You didn't roll a one. We actually have more fuel than we started the game with. Easy. And we have de we have moved one. Yeah, but Woo. we need, we need to spend one fuel and then add. You one. also technically have a second action yeah, yeah. if you want to. We, try we and lose use a it. fuel and then we lose a fuel and then gain two. So we're we're actually we only gained one so overall fuel. You still technically have a second action if you want to try it. However, um, or you can move to a different location just so you're in somewhere useful. But oh, okay, can I? Okay, yeah, I see. I mean, because there's no base star on the board right now, right? No, they might be coming forward, so it might still be worth you staying there. It's just whether we want to move you to somewhere else. You can't really activate right. the engine room. You could, in theory, activate the main batteries later. But... I'm not even allowed to activate the engine room, right? 
Uh, yeah, I can't do engine room or FTL control. Yeah. That's my drawback. And, uh, so <laughs> You might as well stay there, then. <laughs> I'm going to stay, yeah. I'll, I'll just choose to uh, not do a second action. Fair enough. Right. Um, crisis card from Talon, then, finally. Oh, yeah. Uh, okay. So my once-per-game ability is now once-per-game. Yep, you have once-per-game. <laughs> All right. Good news. Carrying breach. All right, this is a green. This is a uh, leadership tactics. Only a six. Um, minus one morale yeah, in all characters good. in the command section, which is me, go to six. <laughs> all right, <laughs> and six. This one is very easy to pass. Wait, and is that bottom left all of this chips that spawn, or is that what activates? What activates? That's what activates what's on the board. I see. Nothing Each human player with though. four or less skill cards in hand may draw two cards. Okay, um, I have. Um, is, that, four five, is it two of any cards or? Four or less skill cards. All right, only so from your card. Only from my card. Wait, okay. so is, is Ra so Rise is the only non human player, right? Yeah. Human because I'm on Galactica. Actually, this is true. He can draw cards because he's on Galactica. Oh, yeah. Okay. So I so oh. I draw two because I only have two skill I, cards. I, I have three skill cards, so I draw two. Yep. And it's just of our choice from our skills. Debbie, you also can draw colors. two cards from your colors. I have plenty. All right. And then obviously we'll start the check once that's done. Cool. So uh, do, do, do. Just waiting for Debbie to draw hers and then we'll do things. Mm -hmm. well, just reckless. Some treachery cards have, in fact, if they're put into a skill check, that it became reckless. Okay. All right. So, uh, Talon, start the skill check, I think. Uh, I'm just going to uh, think. Uh, uh, oh, I shall put in. Um, if you press start check. Yeah, I'm not going to put in anything just in case. I have something. In case something goes wrong, I have a. Um, press the check. start check button, Talon. Yeah, start sequencing. check. All right. So, Debbie's and, the first uh, option. That I would probably pass if you don't have anything useful. Because it's only a low check. It's only a what check? It's only a low only check, six. so we only need six. How many do you have? Well, two random. Uh, two ra it's probably not two, essentially. If, um, I mean, the main, pro main person who needs this to pass is me. So... Right. It is either very... Destiny is either very slightly helpful or very slightly against you. Cards Sorry. face down. Face down. So, uh, so rise. You instead of moving can do this destiny deck thing, right? Yes. Okay, but you did not do that last time. It. Infiltrating Galactica was an action. Right. Oh, so you did do it. Yep. Oh, okay. So you know what the destiny cards are. Yeah, you can probably okay. able to pass this, I think, with seven in. Yeah. Worst case scenario, I have something I can do. Okay. So, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, minus three. So it's five, so we actually do not Just pass. Just a moment. I'm declaring emergency. Yep, reduce its um, limit by two. With, yeah, yeah, I pass. I don't get there, and I, I appreciate it. I no longer believe you are asylum. <laughs> All right, it's seven minus three, so it's actually four. So, yeah. We really needed that. Hmm. I wonder where that came from, because that wasn't on Destiny. What, the red card? The red card was not in Destiny. Uh... Well, he's just saying that because he's a son Well, true. this is true. He could just be saying that. But who knows? Who knows? All right. Um... One of his motives could be get a player killed. Absolutely. <laughs> So, Debbie. That is not one of the moments. We don't know that. You're the only one who's sitting in this deck. <laughs> but fair enough. So, Debbie, it is now. Oh, also, there's no base star, so it, there's no base star that can deploy troops. I wonder, has that changed or not? Because if it's not. So, Debbie, your turn. 
Am I supposed to draw two at the beginning of my turn? No, well, if you press that button um, on your character sheet, that'll draw you your cards for the turn now. Because she's no longer in Because you're no longer bay. in sickbay. Previously you were in sickbay, so you didn't do that. So click that button. button. Yeah. Okay. There you go. So that draws your hand of cards for the turn. Oh. Right. Then you can move to a new location, and then you may do one action. Goodbye, Rise. I'm just going to save the game because occasionally when this is done, this type of thing, it's been. Um... Yes, there's a colonial one destroyed out there. Sorry. So, where am I ultimately trying to get to? <laughs> um, ultimately, we're trying to survive long enough to get through all the dest destiny check. We're trying to jump every turn to try and get ourselves to, um, to the safe point where there are no Cylon attacks. So what we're doing? What can at this... I do for a viper? Uh, if you're in a viper, you can shoot down raiders when they appear on the board. It's probably a reason why you'd have some vipers out um, in preparation. Okay. Uh, how can I jump into a viper? So you're currently in the location for that. Mm -hmm. So you're currently in the hangar deck, which is where where you are. So you can use your action to launch yourself into a viper. You then take one action. Okay. So, you're going to do that? Where's the Vipers? Up here. So, you can either deploy in this or this quadrant. Uh, we'll be over here. Okay, you may then take one action. So, it's going to be a card in your hand or you can move the Viper. At the moment, there's probably not a lot of benefit to moving the Viper because you don't know where they're going to come from, but... Al doesn't go on the Viper. Uh, no, you've got an extra... You got a separate market for that. Um, when do the the what raiders? Uh, they'll they appear as we go through the crisis deck. So there will be new ones at some point, but they're not here right now. We've got away from them. I have a card here that will let me, I, I guess, fire at something, but what should there's, I... There's nothing on the board for you to fire at, so save that until you need it. Um, really, the only moves... It, we're basically in preparation stage. Out of turn? Um, not if it says action. Action, you're going to have to wait until it comes back around to your turn again. Okay. But yeah, there's nothing for us to currently mm -hmm. attack, but obviously that will change as the games, as the turns go on. So really, it's just getting ourselves prepared for mm -hmm. future... Okay. I don't know what else to do. Huh. Alright, then we just go on to the Crisis deck. So draw the top Crisis card. Or reveal the top Crisis card rather than draw it. Uh, yep. There. Right, so Cylon Accusation. So if this is passed. Um, there's no effect. If this fails, the current player is placed in the brick. Me? That'd be you. So if this fails, you're accused of being a Cylon. So we prove my innocence. <laughs> well, basically, you, we have to pass the skill check of 10 to pass the innocence. So if Debbie would click start check. Okay. Hey, Rise, what is the, what, or anyone, what does reckless mean on the card? Uh, you play it before a skill check happens, and if a some treachery cards have negative effects when they're played into a reckless. Okay, I see. 
But both of the treachery cards are out of the Destiny deck, and I haven't drawn any treachery cards, so. Uh, okay. This is true. We haven't noticed him drawing any new treachery, so we're fine for the moment. Might not last. You put more than one card in? You can put as many cards as you want in. You can put your whole hand in if you really desperately need it, but obviously this means you don't have anything for late later turns. So currently both myself and Aegon didn't put anything in. Okay. Um. Wait, you guys didn't put anything in? I didn't put anything in, no. Neither did Aegon, I think. So you guys don't care in. about... So you guys are trying to throw her in the break. Mm -hmm. I didn't say that. Well, I have three cards, so I'm not putting any in mine in either. I'm not putting anything in. If no one else has, I really can't do this alone. They're all Cylons. I mean, I, I, <laughs> I, I could potentially do something to get Debbie out of the brig. We can get you out oh, of the brig I can later. Too. I mean, you never know. I she might reveal two fives. <laughs> yeah, what? So basically, Debbie, um, there's probably not too much point in you putting cards in, but unless you can... unless you can get to over ten. Uh, uh, this 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 isn't right. This is in no way important. But how many people can go in the brig at the same time? Every, everybody, <laughs> everybody, everybody can All be in the brig at the end of this game. <laughs> but there's ways to get out. Somehow I think that's that's the best play somehow. Oh, no more crises at least. This is true. If everybody's on the brig, then the game doesn't progress. <laughs> Until somebody is allowed out. They can't all be Cylons! <laughs> it's probably going to be easy for you to try and make the brig check on your turn, rather than... Um, rather than try and force a 10 by yourself. Just escape from the brig. You, yeah, there's a check. The, the, brig a has, the, the brig has the brig has its own brig. skill. You can escape from the brig on a seven using political and um, tactics. Oh, I'll have to pay seven anyway. Well, true, but you have to either succeed the check of ten or succeed the check of seven later in the game. I'm gonna have to do it anyways, right? At some point, yeah. Mm. Uh, pay the 10. No, Destiny could be against you as well. Yeah, so right, it's, so it's you 10 can't plus have exactly the cards 10. there. Yeah, but it is more likely that they help than hurt, right? Because it's, yeah, three of the five colors. Maybe. <laughs> I mean, this is a big go, this is a big go for it, but... <laughs> okay. Let's see how this panned out. Um, okay. Negative five. So that is six. 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 That? No, it failed. You only got a six. Aww. So because all the blue, all the blue and all the blue and red cards count against you. But doesn't. Well, somebody Blue else, presumably. Yeah, the check was for yellow, green, and um, purple. Oh. I didn't, I didn't realize that. I put some of the blues in. <laughs> okay, you might have been silent then. <laughs> she is, however, back in the brig. What happens to a viper? Does that. Oh, rice is gone again. 
The Viper stays out there. Just yeah, it's, okay, so it's now an unpiloted Viper. So yes. So we basically got her into the airlock, pulled her out of the cockpit, and then pushed the Viper away. <laughs> yep, that's exactly what happened. Um I'll start my turn while we wait for Rice to get back. Uh, okay, that's an interesting card. Duty must be done. Okay. Um, I think we're in desperate need of getting some of these systems back online, so I am going to move and activate the research lab, and I am going to draw an engineering card. Ah. It was not a repair. So don't waste the move on Unfortunate. Me. I mean, in fairness, I'm still in the wrong place because I still have to be in the location to repair it. But, you know, at least it would give us that option going down. Right. Um, okay. So with that having been happened, I'm not going to declare martial law and become the Admiral, even though I want to. Um... President, you mean? Oh, yeah. President. I could be president. Okay. Elections loom. Okay. So this is a... Um, politics and uh, leadership check of eight. No effects on the pass. Five plus for one morale loss. Fail, Oof. and the president four discards cards. four cards. That's president a lot only of cards. Has four cards. Damn. Um, the good news is the jump marker is going to move on from this. All right, so I'm going to press start the check, and we'll see whether Aang wants to keep his cards. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I'm going to need to spend my cards to keep my cards. In fairness, I can I can help you out a reasonable amount. Yeah, I can help a little too. It's only a five plus too. It's not five hard. plus for just okay. the morale loss. We'd prefer not to have it, but I think I think you're safe as long as uh, nonsense doesn't happen. I'm not going to add any just because I don't think I need to. I think you're fine. All right, now just wait for Rice to get back. All mine Ooh. are very very good, high car high value cards. So that, that's stable. what they said. That's what they said at the last election. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. I, I'm, you know, gonna, I'm gonna stay. I'm, I'm gonna stay home for this one. <laughs> I think you're fine. <laughs> I think you'll do fine, dude. Yeah. Uh, yeah Fair. It, it'll be Your fine. Your point is taken. <laughs> Elections are looming, and Aiken is running scared. I'll add a couple of small ones. Up for Aiken, mumble, mumble. Uh, Debbie, I probably wouldn't add cards to the deck until you um, until we need to, because you don't have many cards left. She can also uh, only add one. You also can. You also can only ever add one, but I would save it. Not adding cards. All of your colors are negative. Yeah, all the colors are negative, so I would just pass this unless you are trying to betray Aegon. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm just not going to help because you all sent me to the brig. We didn't send you to the brig. I just did no action. <laughs> I, I I will offer comments. <laughs> all right. Leo. Uh, did you add destiny? Bad guys for you. Uh, we did actually. There were two destinies in there. Okay. What can we do it all? all right, so That's that is. Gonna it's going to be a perfect Nine. pass. Nine. Yeah, perfect pass. No effect. Perfect. <laughs> Moving on to Agen's turn. Thank you. Thank you. The elections are looming and nobody's scared about this. Mumble mumble. Mumble mumble. Now. Also, jump marker moves up by one. Should, should I send Rise to the brig? He's not doing a lot to harm us right now, yeah. but. <laughs> Just as it, a it, prob measure. it probably it isn't a reasonable thing. Also, you would have to move back because ultimately you're on yeah. the um, you're on the colonial one. So, I mean, so you need to fix I'm here. Your step, so, <laughs> yeah, we we could do with the ship being repaired. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Where's no, your? I, I could also get Debbie out of the brig. I mean, I've drawn no treachery. I've drawn engineering this entire game. Yeah. It'd be handy to have an engineer not in prison, wouldn't it? We have an engineer <laughs> not in prison. He's our president. 
Thank you for backing me up, Debbie. Uh, is it Agen's turn? It's Agen's turn, right? Yeah, Agen's just deciding what he's yeah, doing. Yeah, it's... Uh, you need to draw your hand before you do anything, really. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I do need to do that, don't I? You don't have to. Oh, Mickey? Just... Mouse? <laughs> what? Mickey, what? Sorry, I was talking to my girlfriend. I, I, there's a puzzle <laughs> that I'm trying to solve. And I had to figure out a character that's a mouse. <laughs> and that's I'm the gonna... answer. I'm going to move... Back right. to the ship to FTL control. You need to discard a card to change ships. Yep. There's also a Mortimer mouse. Yes. Now I need to figure out a character that's a sheep. <laughs> I'm gonna use this. Show on the sheep. Absolutely. And we have FTL oh, control. Oh, the sheep's not a sheep. Hooray! We can. Uh, we can sacrifice population to get out of here. Damn chap. And now. She was technically a puppet. Not a cartoon. Uh, no. Uh, it, it's Sean. Sean was right. Crisis? Good job. <laughs> yeah, right. And if somebody wants to give me an executive order, I think I could. Well, they'd have to do it on their turn. But yeah. um, okay, if you if you got additional repairs, then um, it's good to know. Yeah, I have additional repairs, and I could also send Rise to the brig and get Debbie out of the brig. <laughs> <laughs> do, do a brig switch. <laughs> Legendary hey, recovery. Okay. Oh, one distance. So, so this, this is a this, good one. If we get pass. a fourteen, we get this. I have a lot of purples in my hand. They're reasonable. Oh. So, uh, I how can... many people have blues? I have a blue, but it's not a repair. Debbie and uh, Rise could. Could. Uh, awesome uh, playing. Oh, all engineering cards count as positive strength. What color is engineering? Blue. Blue. Oh, okay. All skill cards are played face up. Oh, dang. That no, sounds like a check we're going to pass right. now. Yep. Uh, Hell yeah. Press start check, uh, Egan, and we'll begin things. So, put the card in draw face your up. One card, Egan. Oh, yeah, draw draw one card before um, Egan. Wait, is green this. good for this? No, green is bad. It's just Green's purple. bad. It is literally purple and red. All right. Well, I will add this nice face up card. Five. Okay, good. What, why did I draw a card? Oh, because I, I... I think you're hovering over the, the thing. thing. was, Yeah, the thing was on top of my... Yeah, that was bad place. Yeah, I'll take it with this scientific research in. Okay, nine showing. I can't help with this one. Debbie, as you no, are... Mate, no green cards? Oh, wait, green is bad. Right. That, I, no, I want Debbie, to green as card. you are in the brig, you can add a maximum of one card, but you have to add it face up, so we see what it is. Or you can pass. And the good uh, cards are purple, red, and blue. Purple, red, and blue are the good ones. If you want to add one face up. What would passing this accomplish? We'd move slightly uh, closer to um, the objective. We are closer to winning the game. Well, the humans are closer to winning the game. True. But we're all humans, right? Of course we are. Yes. Um, but just... Oh, uh, right. Oh. Just reset the destiny deck because that was the usage. You can only ever add, you can only have one card though, because break. Yep. Okay. So she two. Uh, nice. Okay, I'm gonna add. We're a... in pretty good shape. If you just add one like hefty card, and we'll probably be fine. Or a few. Yeah. Can we add four? And just do we see the destiny deck? No, no we haven't. No, we don't see the destiny deck. How many cards? Two do cards you... from a destiny deck get added to this. So. Okay, I'm also going to play this one just to okay. make sure. Should be good. Should be all good. Let's play out and see how many. So we have a negative three. Uh, no, negative... that's a positive. Yeah, positive. Oh, no, that's positive. Sorry, sorry, negative one. Yep, that is distance. Am I good now? No! <laughs> You'll never be good. All right, so we've made a distance of two. Six to go. Yay! Ooh. We're getting there, and then everything goes wrong when we get to four, as always. <laughs> I get to draw any cards. So now it is my turn. It, yep, it is right? your turn. 
I will draw my set. Uh, you'll draw cards when it gets back to your turn. Okay. All right. I got some stuff and some things. Absolutely. Um, we get to draw you one miscellaneous. Oh, thank you. Right. Good. Oh, Maybe I'll get a card that'll actually let me do something. <laughs> sure didn't. All right. So what would be good to do this turn? We're still Let's in kind see. of preparation mode, but you can't activate yeah. the engine room. <laughs> oh, I think I brought... <laughs> If you Am can I just repent, do nothing? If you can repent, you can executive order somebody so they can do some repairs. Oh, that's true. Okay, who can do some repairs? I can do. I can repair, or I can get more cards. I can do a repair, and I can get Debbie out of the break. This greedy dude who wants more cards will not be the one who can do it. So, <laughs> all right. So executive order. That means that Agen has a move and on a Agen. move in action or two actions where yeah. he is. Yeah. I'm going to use it on our faithful president rather than the Cylon leader infiltrating our ship, if that's okay with you, Ryze. <laughs> Fair, but I did get that distance, so... Yeah, that's but true. We we're going to get you that anyway. You did play cards face up. <laughs> Do I don't we... know. If we had played cards face down, who knows what would have happened. Do I repair the Admiral's quarters or the armory? We don't have any infiltrators, and we're not at a risk for that. That, w that will be important, but... Um... It depends who you want to throw in the brig. Well, if we have the Admiral's Quarters, then we can murder people with my ability, so... <laughs> so he's... <laughs> so do you have so the ad Armory, right? <laughs> yeah, it's sounding like the Armory, in all honesty. <laughs> I, I think Kenny is being very in character. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna I, mean, be a toaster. I do have a, a card that could send people to the brig right now, so I think I'm gonna do the Armory, because... We might get boarded at some point. Yeah, probably. Okay, so there's a repair. And hey, Galactica only has one bit of damage on it, so it's all good. Yeah, the, the office is still not... <laughs> Look, we don't need the Admiral's courses because I'm not the Admiral right now. Yeah, all right. if you were, it would be the only thing that gets fixed. Holy <laughs> Christ, <laughs> All right, let's see how bad this is going to go. Sooner or later, it will go bad. What's up? Uh, crisis. Ah, okay. Crisis. I shall reveal crisis. water shortage. President's food. choice. Uh, the president discards two skill cards, and I discard three skill cards. Or we oh, lose a food. Not nice we, got, we got plenty of food, I'm thinking. It's <laughs> on food. Yeah, otherwise that's that's like all but one of your cards. I have a lot, but... Oh, it's... Yeah. Or are we on ice cream? <laughs> well, that'll be in the food. Yeah, yeah. Well, well, I mean, that would be the last of the food. Probably food. That would be the last... Depending long enough, it's considered a drink. <laughs> that would be the last of the food because it's a dessert, so... <laughs> Absolutely. So are we losing a food, Egan? So yeah, we're losing a food. Yeah. <laughs> nice to know where our president's priorities lie. <laughs> Some of you may die, but that is a sacrifice I am willing to make. Good news is I can take that presidency away from him at any point in my turn. <laughs> if I want Thank to. You, uh, well, you can give it to the Admiral, so you yeah. can give it to me. But I need to be the Admiral first before I use that. Or you can give it to me. No, I need, I need the Admiral. <laughs> so my turn. Yep, it's Rice's turn. Drop politics. Engineering. And for my own filtration, I'll draw an engineer. Oh god, my back. <laughs> well, you've managed to get the ship in pretty good shape. So now, you're gonna, you now you're gonna betray us again. That's the face of God. Yeah, no, that's not going back on top. Plots and he schemes against us. Yep. Ooh, my back. Welcome back. No, no, my back. What about your back? And then we'll draw two tactics. It hurts. It's this time. Okay, let's see what we're doing. Rescue mission. Admiral's choice. 
Ah, great. So minus one, and we send Rise to Sick Bay. <laughs> or lose a mule uh, character. I mean, uh, I mean, I have no because... problem sending Rise to Sick Bay. <laughs> I mean, yeah, just because you're on two distance and nine fuel, I would say that. But I un and your morale is minus three. But I understand if you do. That. I mean, so far Rise has been only helpful. That's but... the trap. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's the trap <laughs> it's up to you but we, um, like Rice says you generally do have more fuel than um, than things and losing yeah, one raptor is uh, probably not the end of the world right now yeah I'm gonna say fuel and a raptor you live for now Rise. alright I've thrown a raptor away <laughs> good news is blink oh god and we're still not being attacked by the and to, be, and to be fair I'm giving you guys jump prep so Oh, that's true. You are giving us jump prep, yeah. Yeah, yeah, fair. Talon! Right. Draw? Yep. Okay. And I did give you guys cards as well, so... You haven't been awful yet. No. Not <laughs> yet. There's plenty Just of Just how far that, in though. advance do we want to kill you, though, is the question. <laughs> <laughs> We can break Arguably, three turns after I've already left the ship. <laughs> I think the safest option is for all of us to voluntarily lock ourselves up in the brig. Yep. <laughs> the game never ends, but, you know, we I don't mean, lose. We still draw crisis cards. We still yeah, get so the game killed. would probably end, just not well for the human. In the brig, you don't draw crisis cards. You don't. Oh. Um, the, oh. only, the only problem, of course, is that you can't have one skill check for everything. Uh, what are you playing? I'm going to launch a scout. All right, risk a raptor to look at the top crisis deck. Okay. Roll or up. destination Free deck, out. but I'm assuming crisis. <laughs> just. Okay. You, just. you can look at the top crisis or destination deck and put it to the top of the bottom. Uh, I will look at the destination deck, actually. Okay. Okay, flip. Uh, Remember, the Admiral gets a choice of two, so even if that one's included, he may not take it. Um, I think this is okay. None of them are really good. It's, it's a, we got a new Raptor. <laughs> We've made it out of a planet. <laughs> uh, All right, and uh, I guess I have to do a crisis now. Yeah, absolutely. Remember, you had the option of getting rid of this. What? <laughs> you could have looked at this and gotten rid of it. Oh, my. Another president, president choice. Hello, sir. Okay, oh, do we rescue wow. the Caprica survivors or not? We can get minus fuel, minus food, plus population, or minus morale. Well, we have uh, to very much like it at the top. <laughs> I mean, I think we lose morale. Okay. Who's leading all the Hagen does? Because we. <laughs> I'm ambivalent to that decision. <laughs> are there other ways uh, does morale get affected in other ways or is it just from uh, this I, had a, I mean I had a card that raised morale a while but like if people that. die does morale go down oh yeah or is that not if you kill humans I yes it's not a card though okay depends on if a funeral is your idea of a good time <laughs> I, hear, I hear in New Sorry. Orleans it's a great time <laughs> okay uh, we then move on to Debbie's turn so draw her okay, cards for turn we get some spaceships that I can attack by the time my turn comes around? Thanks. Don't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> it depends how it draws. And Debbie doesn't draw a crisis deck unless she gets out of the brig. So, Debbie. Sure. I'm yeah. bored. I uh, want energy. You may not move, draw crisis cards, or add more than one card to check. You can play actions from your hand, I believe, or you can use the brig action to try and get out. The skill check is still a group skill check, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay, so we can help her get out. We can help her get out. Yeah, I'll help you get out if you do that. Mm. She can reveal herself as a Cylon. She can also reveal uh, herself as a Cylon to um, get out of the, the, the <laughs> <laughs> Interest, that would be a quite an early Cylon reveal, you would think. <laughs> the thing is, she gets two cards in the next phase, so that's when she's dodgy. <laughs> That's when we're all dodgy. Well, you're more dodgy it's than most like of us, but, you know, we know you're playing the long game. You've been dodgy from the beginning. 
Oh, I, I don't draw a second card on the second draw. No, you get two at the start, so... Yeah. <laughs> You're I've been, a, I'm, I'm, I've been a good president. I'm not a... That's questionable. You haven't done anything presidential yet. What I want I've know made decisions. Is when are you going to look at all the loyalty cards belonging... I guess after the sleeper phase. <laughs> Well, yeah. I don't trust the it, uh, it makes sense to do it after the sleep phase because otherwise his information is kind of out of date. <laughs> right. Was I not supposed to draw cards until after I escape the you bridge? Don't, you, can, you draw your cards as normal, but you don't draw crisis, cards from a crisis deck, so you can't mm. advance the crisis clock. Okay. Unless, so, unless you get out of the brig this turn. This would be a skill check to get me out? Yep. So you basically what would happen is we'd, you'd click Destiny and start a check, and then we'd all vote on whether we let you out, basically. <laughs> So, okay. do you think so? Uh, seven based on political and on tactics cards. So, yellows and purples. Seven out of yellows and purples. Yep. And obviously, everyone gets a chance to put cards in that. Okay. We're going to do break? Yep. So, yeah. click Destiny and then click Start Check. No, I'm going to get her out. Uh, Who did that? I am okay. very sorry. <laughs> Alright, I've reverted. I know this tends to cause issues for people, so let me know that everything's loaded back in correctly. I, I am I am very sorry. I meant to click the menu. <laughs> <laughs> sure right. he did. Alright, Debbie. Now that we have a clear silent opponent, uh, if you click <laughs> Destiny oh and start deck and we can uh, start the check. You really did not want her to get out yeah, of the bridge. Uh, you, we <laughs> want to get her out. I am sorry. <laughs> and then start check. Wait, but before I do that, I do want to get her out. I can make it easier in general to get her out. Uh, this is a fair point. You actually do have the ability to um, to increase or reduce by two. What is this? Is this once per game? or This is friends no, in low places. My, he just has a permanent sure. ability to adjust oh, this. By you two. may as well make it easier. Break. Yeah, make it easier. I, right, I don't I'll see make any it reason why we're keeping her in there. At least for now, I think Boomer is fine. Yeah. After the, after the um, sleeper phase, I am not guaranteeing that. <laughs> wait, wait. So, oh, Debbie adds last. Okay. Yeah. It, it, it's just, the order it's done it in. It's just for logic sense. So. What does this need to be? This needs to be seven uh, from politics and no, tactics. five now. And the Destiny deck still plays. Oh yeah, we still have Destiny cards in. So two from Destiny. Destiny deck, deck is not an entity. All right, I can throw one in then. I'll tell you that now. <laughs> Destiny is a non-entity. I've got help already. I'm going to pass, so no one suspects me. <laughs> All right, Debbie. So you can add um, either purples or um, yellows to try and get you out. How many are in there so far? Uh, there are four yeah. cards total: two random, one added from Agen, and one added from Talon. I think. Did you add one? No, no from I me. Added nothing. Okay, I added one. Yeah, that's fine. So one added from Agen, one added from Black Hat. You can only put one card in. And you can only put one card in. Yeah, this is true. I can only do one. Yeah, because in the break you add, you can only ever add one. So you should probably just put your highest purple or yellow card in, and then click done. Layout, and we'll see what happens from that. So, that looks good. Minus one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Minus one is six. Nice. All right, so Debbie, you may move out of the break to another location. Just made it. Thought I had to get seven or higher. Um, uh, I, no, so Tom Zarek has an ability that makes it easier or harder, and he chose to make it easier. So Talon Tom, made your life easier. Yeah. Yay. So you may now move your character to another location. Which means you get to draw a crisis card. That's your reward. <laughs> so if you've got repairs and want to repair the Admiral's quarters, that might be useful. If not, just move somewhere. You can't activate the location this turn, but obviously you're prepared for next turn. Oh, boy. If this crisis card screws us all, I know who to blame. <laughs> uh, from weapons control, I can shoot down Cylon ships. Yeah, there aren't any on the board at the moment, but I mean, it might still be useful to be there for next turn. Remember, also, you are a pilot, so you probably do want to be out in Vipers at some point in the future, so being in the hangar deck is not a bad option for you, usually. Yeah. If you've got a repair that we could activate, your Admiral's Quarters is fine, but the hangar is probably a bit sensible for you at the moment. Okay. So, then draw the card of Crisis. 
and find out what's going on. Right, uh... So flip the card over, or ah, the top one. Just... Yep. Oop. Oop. Today's Saturday, right? That's Today correct. Today is Saturday, yeah. yes. Cylon virus. Uh, um, the good news. Oh. Ah. The good news is this doesn't actually do anything. Except for adds a, it does add a centurion marker, right? Yes. Yeah. So it does start the boarding action. Well, I could. Maybe it gives you guys something to do. It would give us something to yeah, do. Yeah. This, this doesn't seem like too big a deal. Yeah, but usually trouble doesn't come alone, so it's going to be a Centurion Mark, and then the next two Crisis cards are going to be just... It's fine. We've got Garrick who can deal mm. with them. Gaius who can deal with them. we got Garrick? Yeah, Gaius. <laughs> wrong Def series. Yeah, wrong series, but, but basically same character. <laughs> the definite traitor. Yeah, uh, yeah. I, I am not, I, I'm not Harrison Ford on... <laughs> Uh, press start check, um, Debbie, and we'll try and see whether we're going to have um, things to worry about. So, um... I'm not Harrison Ford on Air Force One. <laughs> you could be. We don't know this. Um, I'm adding. I'm adding a little bit of help, but it's not anywhere near enough to get to 13. Um, yeah. If we fail this, everybody goes to sick bay. No, only if anyone was in FTL control. Yeah. So, the person in FTL control would go to sick bay. Um, but also, we get boarded by the Cylons. I don't just have one. any. I don't have anything. I'm not. I this doesn't sound bad enough. We're gonna to get me boarded by Cylons. <laughs> you sound like that hasn't already happened. Uh, I well, can't anywhere obvious, near. obvious Cylon is obvious. <laughs> so wait, what? How does boarding, getting boarded work? What does that Basically, do? Basically, um, it starts there. Whenever we we roll heavy raider. Um, the boarding party advances along the track. Uh huh. When it gets to there, we lose. Oh, we just lose. Yeah, we just lose if this continues on for too long. Oh, so that's not great. I see. Wait, so how does it move? Uh, whenever we we draw a heavy raider card, so um, card in the bottom uh, corner. That's one. That's one that shows these guys. Yeah. So basically, one oh, of the I see. Okay. Uh, where are they? Uh, no, no uh, these. I'm just gonna. So whenever it shows, yeah, whenever it shows heavy raider, the centurions advance. I see. Because it, it doesn't say that on here. Okay, well, this doesn't seem yeah. like a great effort with four cards, but let's see. I see. No. No. <laughs> Six. So good news, everybody. You got exactly zero. You did. You did yeah. Uh, where's the? Here they are. Centurion Marcus. There. Oh, I see. We're okay. good. You added one. My turn then. Come on, executive order me. I want to shoot a gun. <laughs> <laughs> shoot a gun at who? I mean, I don't know a lot better to do in all honesty than just give you two shots at this. The problem is you'd need a seven or an eight. What do you have anything that helps you against this or No, I just want to shoot a gun. <laughs> oh, you can attack the centurion, I see. Yeah, he's in the armory, so he actually can do this. Alright, fine. I'm gonna executive order you to give you two actions or a moving action, and please take two actions. <laughs> I'll take more ice creams. I'll take one shot at the Before you roll, does anyone have anything to help this? Help what? The roll to try and kill the, the centurion. Roll. Kill a centurion. Uh... Yeah, would be useful. Anything that would improve a die roll. No. All right, then no. just have a go. Seven, seven up to kill. Four. Well, you're useless. No. Try again. Se second action. Strategic <laughs> planning. Okay. Add. Okay, so add two to the die roll. Okay. Uh, Rises. Rise is the most helpful Fine. Cylon we've Fine. ever met. Yeah. That, that does it. Yeah. That works. Yep, we, yep, remove him. Yay. Wow. Well, thank you. I am I am amazing in, at ordering people around in a drunken tirade. Anyway. <laughs> Crisis. Boom. There's more water shortage. <laughs> wow. All oh, right. President, <laughs> why do we have no water? <laughs> President, what are we losing? I mean, I think I'm going to discard my skill cards. Wow. Because I'm next. But I... Oh, 
fine, but I really don't want to discard mine. Oh, you have to discard oh, three. Oh, yeah. hold on, hold on. Oh. It's I mean, two from I, you I, and I, three I, from I the I can do play. it, but I'm... Oh, how much food do we have? I mean... <laughs> I've can, I can I can survive this. It's fine. I don't lose anything major. I lose I, mean, I lose a couple of scouts and, a, and a, an executive order. So that's what I'm losing. I can afford to lose this if you want. Oh boy. I have a, mostly a full grip of cards anyway. So. Well, we can do soil and green at some point. So we're going to lose food. <laughs> Absolutely, True. you're definitely going to get soil. All right, all right. Remember, the president decided this was the best way. Yes. <laughs> yes, not like they were lobbyists or anything. No, no, no. This is just going to add fuel to the fire of when I take his presidency away. Oof. All right, over to you, Egan. Draw my cards. Okay. What can I do? What can I do? What can I do? Oh. Uh... Well, all things considering, I've got to do this. I've got to consult the Oracle. Uh, oh. Don't you have to be in the presence of oh. play those? Or... Okay. I'm going I, I, to I, I, was, I was more asking Rice to confirm that, but I think you have to be. Quorum cards, you can just play from your hand. Oh, okay. That's fine. That's fine. I, think, I think last game we were playing that as you had to be in presence of, but yeah, you can play those. I'm gonna be consult the oracle. I'm gonna look at a card, bottom card of any one deck. Of any one. Then look. Any deck, and then look at the top two. No, look at all the cards of the Destiny deck and discard two of them. Okay. Okay. If I can look at the bottom card. So what? Is, what how does that the, help? the reason that the reason why that's relevant is because you can see what somebody puts to the bottom. Because there's various options where you keep the card on top or put it on the bottom. I don't think there's any deck though that somebody's put something to the bottom. At yeah, this point. I mean, it would I be better to save that until after we jump, and then you can check what he puts on the bottom of the deck. Well, we did have one jump. And, yeah, yeah, but, but he only had one card. Was, we had no I choice. Yeah, I would, yeah, I, would I would, I would hold off for that and just, you know. Okay. Uh, yeah. Either increase the number of cards in your hand, or um, generally get things repaired. Well, I don't have any repairs. Oh. Yeah, then go to the research lab and just um, get some more cards. No, 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 I'm gonna, I'm gonna draw two skill cards of any type. Okay. Oh, let's, wait, that's the discard deck there. Okay. Okay. And what else can I do? I thought it was an action. Can I still move, or can do I get another action? You have to move before you do your action. You are supposed to move before you do your action. It's fine. Nah. Well, not like I have anything to do. So. Well, now you just have to cause a crisis. Crash landing! Hooray! We're in a crisis. We're low on ice cream. All right, start it up. Doesn't seem so bad. I mean, I mean it's a it's a, low, it's a low quality one, so we can get through this. Yeah. Okay. Uh oh. Start yeah. It up. Okay. Oh, uh, destiny. Yep, destiny. Start check, and then pass the cards around. I yeah, mean, it's not, it's not the end, the end of the end world, it. and I have tons of cards that I can add to this. It depends what gets done. I'm, I'm not adding, adding because I get to decide, so that's cool. <laughs> Fine. I mean, you can send the president to sickbay, which doesn't seem like a great idea, but... Treason! <laughs> that's one step closer to murdering him, though, and that is a great idea. Uh, Aiden, did you draw a card before you did this? Um... Oh, 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 oh. You probably want a tactics for a piloting. <laughs> Be much easier to murderize him if he had needles in him already, though. This is true, <laughs> but maybe that's just the Cylon um, thing taking over. <laughs> uh, you gonna add anything, Debbie? Or? Um. 
Which colors? Uh, red, purple. Red and purple. Well, red and purple if you want it to succeed. Anything else if you want it to fail. <laughs> but remember to put the cards in face down if you're doing so. No one is being very helpful. I know. Not much of a loss, really. Well, apparently we don't we don't care about the president going to sick bay. That's or all. we don't care about fuel or morale, which I feel like we do care about. Yeah, I know. Oh, well. It's all aim out. This seems all right. But yeah, I think we're okay. Uh, minus two. Yes. Minus two, one, two, three, four, five, six, six seven, eight, nine. Yep. Seven. Oh, uh, barely actually. Yeah, well, that's fine. <laughs> no effect. Right. Nice. And See, I didn't need to put anything in. Anyway. On. So over to um, you, sir. Yes, the murder woman. All right. Remember, draw your extra one. <laughs> yes. I might have to discard. A, p a president who's a traitor and an admiral who wants to murder everybody. <laughs> what could go wrong? And absolutely nothing. This is perfectly fine. I mean, you don't have to stay on the Pegasus. You can come over and uh, do some other things. Although there's not a lot. I live on the Pegasus. The Pegasus is my home, my friend. No, there's like literally nothing to do on the Pegasus. I think I will come over, especially because I have a billion cards right now. But yeah. the Admiral's Quarters isn't available for me to murder someone, so it's really a, a wash where I go at that point. Then. I mean, you could throw some Vipers out <laughs> if you really wanted to, something to do. Draw an Engineering yeah. card, just so you've got one in hand, so you can go back That's and fair. That's repair. not bad. Um, you, am you, I allowed you, to go to the President area? Yeah, you can go to that ship. You can start an administration and try to... Um... Oh, trying to become the admiral to president some, make, that seems you can unlikely make somebody else the president yeah I'd, I'd vote for it. i was tempted to but i'm gonna uh draw an engineering card okay so discard a card first off for moving between ships yes i will discard this card yep you draw an engineering and then crisis yes draw let's see what this thing is Okay, not what I wanted, but that's fine. <laughs> and unsettling Unset stories. Stories. Current player chooses. Either we do a skill check, and if we fail, we lose a morale, and each player discards a skill card and draws a treachery card, or we lose a morale. That's very bad. I feel like we can pass this, though. I have plenty to add, so. Okay. Well, we'll do the check. We will, in fact, leave a check then. Okay, Destiny, start check. Start check. We need destiny. Okay. Oh, my bad. That's fine. Do the other way just make sure we do add them. All right. Uh... The Cylon <laughs> has no problems with this because he wants treachery cards, I'm sure. Of course, of course, of course. <laughs> if we don't pass, we lose more ice cream. No, just I'll morale. A couple. Oh, how much morale do we have left? Six. Six. I mean, morale is plummeting a little bit, but we're still. We're, I mean, actually, we're only a quarter way through the game, so. <laughs> Rise, did you face of God last turn? Uh, I have no clue in this. That's not. We it. got used up on Debbie's. Oh, that's drink. right. So it's mystery. That's scary. It's a mystery. We'll add one. I'm ready to shoot Cylons in the face. Yeah, but they haven't heard yet, so it's all good. We can travel off before they get to us. Good. Good. Uh... You know, things are going a bit too smoothly for you guys. Yeah, but they're going slowly, that's the We're big... about to go into sleeper agent phase, so... Are we? We are only moved two distance, we still have to move Yeah, two but more. I, you, we're going to have the choice, and almost certainly there's going to be a two that appears. Uh, Is that uh, a so 17? Two, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight. Minus eight, so zero. Um, Nine minus eight, so one. Wow. Okay, I really thought we could pass that. Yeah, apparently, though, somebody put something in that wasn't supposed to be there. Not high. Well, uh, whatever you say about that. But um, basically now, we lose a morale. Gross. We're now in the red for morale, by the way. Um, we all need to discard a skill card and draw a treachery card. Gosh. Right, so I will discard that, and I will get this repair. Oh, do we get Cylon sympathizers in this store? Uh, there's six oh, of us, so yes, we should have one. 
Dude, does this mean they don't become Cylon sympathizers because we're in the red? Because there's a Cylon leader, there's not a Cylon sympathizer. Oh. Uh, Debbie, draw a treachery card if you haven't done. A treachery card. Oh, I, do I need to oh, draw yeah. a treachery card? Where are they? Curd, curd, and draw a treachery card. Yeah. We all draw, have a treachery. We all draw a treachery card or... Yeah. Yes, we have no silence. Each player no... discards one skill card and draws one treachery card. Ah, oh, yeah. Right. Discard a skill card. Hackers. Uh, Hackers. Okay. Or does it matter where we discard? Your discard goes in the color of the pile you discard yeah. it. And You're then move the bottom. moves on. So, goodness is, we're one from jumping again, which should be nice. Yes, we have no bananas. We do, in fact, have no bananas. We have some All right, uh, and I am done. All right. So, on to our Cylon friend. Indeed. I'm sure, do, 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 do. I'm sure it's going to be very helpful this time. Politics. He's drawing Too a treasure. Yeah, really helpful. <laughs> and he's My turn's done. Your turn is done. You have to just... Oh, because you're uninfil... You're using your action to end your infiltration. Yep, and I'm not in the brig, so I don't discard. Yep. Okay. okay. I told you we should have locked him up. We should have. Next time. Next time. All right. Tell will be back. <laughs> do the yeah. thing. I mean, I also have things I can do to help you guys up here, so... Yeah, that all looks extremely helpful. Yeah, those are all really helpful, yep. I mean, this lets me... Give you guys a jump prep. <laughs> <laughs> yep, that's what that does. <laughs> yep, that's exactly what it does. Uh, do crisis with... card? Uh, no, I haven't decided what I'm going to do yet. Uh, that was the crisis card, yeah. Talon's just doing his thing at the moment. Um... Wait, no, doesn't doesn't Rise have to draw a crisis nope. card? No, nope, he's not. Um... He's not a player now. He's not a human player right now. Oh, okay, okay. I don't know what to do here. Um... Well, we don't have anything we need to do, right? but obviously you're going to lose That's cards from your hand anyway, so... Really the most thing I can do is give me cards, so... Uh... I mean, if you've got any scouts or anything that you can send out, might as well go for that. Yeah, what the heck, I'll use, I will use a scout and check out the... Uh, I already checked out the destination before, so I'll check out the crisis cards. Yep, it's fine, so roll the roll roll, dice. Roll dice first. Just... You, don't get, you don't just get to do it, you need to roll to see if you can. Because we, right, we lose yeah. the... Um, the raptor if this fails okay good so you can now check out the top card and put it on the top of the bottom preferably we want something with a um, jump symbol here ideally i want to shoot cylons in the face we don't yeah, want we, cylons to appear just preferably yet. we want something with cylons that we can shoot no no it's cylons oh, wait, i'm not on the pegasus anymore just kidding. no cylons if you just, don't want to shoot cylon invasion put it to the bottom yeah <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, I'll leave it on the top. It's, we're, it's a tough choice. We remember but... this. We will remember this. All right. Mm -hmm. Um. Then no, go to. Me after, you turn, after this card. Uh, no, you do crisis first. Oh. Crap. So now we have uh, to see what that card is. You put back on top. Well, food shortage. President chooses minus two food or minus one food, and the president discards two skill cards, and the current player discards three. I can discard it, no problem. You kept the food on top. Prep. It does have a jump prep. I'm gonna be no, I'm kind of glad I left what I did, because otherwise you guys could have hit me with that. <laughs> okay, we're... we're Look I'm at this, you can start discarding your treachery cards. You're discarding? Okay, so minus one food then. Yeah. So can we discard the treachery cards without any problem? Can I discard? Uh, there are treachery cards that let you play when other people discard treachery cards, but I'm not sure anyone will do that. I think so. Every treachery card do that, and I'm not going to. Okay. Get to or we can't. So, no, you don't. Get to Just... your treachery? Oh. Well, there's cards that allow you to activate when that happens, but... Um... Alright, and how many do I have to get rid of? Uh, current player president discards three, of... president discards two. Yeah. Two Child for president, three for I discarded two. I discarded a power and a. 
executive decision. Why are we leaving this area of space? It's completely safe. Yeah, we should be staying here. All right, the Admiral draws the top two cards from a destination deck, puts one to the top, one to the bottom, and then we go to the one he keeps. Here we go. Okay. Oh. Preferably two (laughs) to move us into Sleeper Agent, but... um... Well, I have good news. They're both two. (laughs) Good. But other than that, they're not great. We don't. Think none, of them are, none of them are great. Okay, so we're gonna throw throw this one to the bottom. Okay, I'll put it on top. Okay. And then we will be going to the Cylon Refinery, which I promise is better than the other one. Fair enough. Okay, so a few things happen here. First off, we lose one deal. Yep. Uh, then... Second, the Admiral may risk two Vipers to. We have uh... like a million Vipers. I think we're gonna do it. On a six or higher. Okay, before you... Oh, it's only on a six or higher? Wait, never mind. I was about to say, I it. can adjust the roll, but only a little bit. You won't do it. I can, I, can, I can adjust the roll to make it a 50-50. If you uh... want my question, you will be doing the roll. If we want your what? If you want me to help you out, you want to do the roll. Ah, uh, I Wink. see. Nudge, nudge. I feel like I... I'm not the kind of character who would take threats from a Cylon. Absolutely. <laughs> so oh, we're going to not do the roll. Fair enough. Grumble, no, grumble, keep, keep grumble. That, keep, that, keep that there, because that's our oh, death. Yes. That's trouble. All right, yes. we enter sleeper agent phase. So um, everybody except Rise draws from that deck. All right. And then... We'll find out whether there's any new Cylons or not. Well, actually, we won't find out, but you know. Um, Debbie also draws two cards during this phase because of her thing. I think she's done that. Back to the big, Boomer. And then Boomer goes to the brig, yes. Yep. (laughs) Come on, I have two cards. Someone dealt me one. Yeah, you're supposed to get If you look at the bottom of your character sheet, you're supposed to get two at this point, and also you'll move to the brig. So you're going to have to get out of the brig again. (laughs) It's fine, we might let you out, who knows. I don't trust any of the two... uh... Look, basically both Gaius and (laughs) Debbie have the same chance of being a Cylon, which is only slightly more chance than the rest than the other three of us. Yeah, true. The only one we know we don't trust is Rise. Yes. (laughs) I can actually run away for us to do anything with him. (laughs) I can run with either team, assuming you blow up some vipers. (laughs) <laughs> well, we're never going to encounter vipers. That is the plan. That is the game plan right now. <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, you want me to be a silent? Got it. Got it. Absolutely fine. All right. Um. So with that done, we whose turn is it? It's. I just found that was. What step is? All right, Debbie. So, it is now your turn. You are in the brick. Draw your cards for the turn. Yeah, draw your cards and then activate the brig skill check again. If you think you can I get don't. out, I'm not going to be helpful this time. She could probably get herself out. I'm assuming. Well, we'll see. The only one, only one card. Oh right, she's, she's only probably one gonna... card. And... Oh, that's unfortunate. So yeah, if, she's... Oh. if she is a Cylon, she can activate the cards and suddenly start playing as a Cylon. But she might not be. So you're not going to help me out of here because you think I'm a Cylon? That's that's the yeah. theory at the moment. I want to shoot Cylons in the face. <laughs> well, um, I guess we start the skill check then. So, Destiny and I'm start skill. I'm going to leave it neutral. I'm not going to help or hinder it. Okay. What's the point of that? Well, because well, I could have made it worse. he doesn't know. We <laughs> could have made it worse. <laughs> Alright, so Debbie, you going to use the brick check? I don't see a lot of point in it if I'm just going to stay sitting in here and lose well, my card. Well, do we else trust her or not? I'm not sure. Uh, I mean, yeah, I'm not it's sure. probably worth doing anyway, just because that's the, pretty much the only thing you can do at this point. The, unless you are a Cylon, in which case you can, act, you can reveal you're a Cylon and then start playing as a Cylon player. Out of Cylon. Okay, that's fine then. That's fine. Then you're gonna to have to try and get out of the brig to prove. What happens when if she revealed herself? She, she would, would move. Get out of the brig. Okay, uh, Destiny. Just for that. Sneakers. 
But no crisis, at least. Uh, That's true. Need? Well, if we if she doesn't get out. <laughs> I'm adding two. Adding two. Helping her out or leaving her in, I guess. Oh, hold on. <laughs> Sorry. Wasn't looking at the screen. Uh, I have nothing. So. That sounds like a practice lie, but carry on. <laughs> <laughs> I will help. I'm a politician. Not for long if I've got anything to say about it. Hard one. Unfortunately, that would mean giving somebody else the presidency. I'm here. You can give me I'm the presidency. I'm putting one in. I don't want to give you the presidency. I want you to prove to asylum and then give me the nukes. <laughs> Looking like a Cylon. You got, I mean, in fairness, there are at least two Cylon cards out in the game at this point. Oh yeah, so now it's guaranteed that there are two Cylons. There could have been zero before, correct? Well, they, they, I mean, in right. fairness, it's not guaranteed there's two. There could be one, but there's at least two yeah. Cylon cards out there. Right, but there could have been zero initially. Oh yeah, there could have been none yes. in the previous phase. Okay. So, layout. So, looking at this, we oh, have... Oh, the comes out, it looks like. Three... Uh, there's a Cap 5 <laughs> engineering in there. So, um, oh, yeah. Oh, wait, so breakfast <laughs> yeah. check. Do we get a base star in Galactica and a civilian ship behind? It's not a reckless check. No. Oh, uh, that's if said... someone played a reckless card. No, oh, no, we... someone did play a reckless card. Guts and initiative. Guts and initiative. No, that, that only counts if it's played beforehand. If it's played before, ah, then that would be for that. So ah. that is a failed skull check. Oh. Yeah, I wow. figured I might as well start decorating the walls in here. I tried to help. All right, but you don't draw a crisis card, so it then moves on to my turn. Yes. And Debbie gets to do her recon first. Oh, yeah, you do. Oh, yeah. You get to look at the top card of the Crisis deck and place it on the top or the bottom. Yeah. So, Debbie, you can put, draw the top card of the Crisis deck and either keep it on top or move it to the bottom. Your choice. Mm, okay. Hmm. <sighs> Goodbye, Aiken. No, this probably isn't so bad to have on top. Okay, so put that back on top, and it's my turn. So, I will draw my set of cards. And... Right. Cylon attack. Come on. Come on, Debbie. Be a Cylon. I'm not 100% convinced she is. Um, however, what I'm going to do for my own sort of... Um, actually, I don't know whether I want to do that or not. I'm going to go to command and I'm going to launch a couple of Vipers. You don't know if you want to reveal yourself as a Cylon or not? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> Absolutely. But I'm going, to release, okay. I'm, going to, yes. I'm going to start preparation and put some couple of Vipers on the board. Um, okay. Right, so let's find out what Watch. Debbie put on top for us. He's making a Cylon. Sleep deprivation. Admiral chooses. Oh. Either we lose that our well or all the Vipers <laughs> got... <laughs> that would have been bad had you not done that. Well... <laughs> So you can undo my entire turn. <laughs> and send you to sick bay. Yep. <laughs> or, or minus one morale. Well, our morale is quite Our morale low. is dangerous. I would put me in sick bay. I am putting you in. I'm just annoyed bay. that I, you've just undone my entire turn. <laughs> <laughs> you might as well have just moved to sick bay on your turn. The good news is at least the jump did move on. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's true. We did get a jump prep. Um, if somebody can use an executive order to get me out of there, I would be appreciative, but we'll see <laughs> if that happens. Aiken's turn. <laughs> okay, Aiken, what are you up to? Oh, did he fall out of his chair? Oh, he's not in Discord anymore. Oh. Fell out of his chair. <laughs> no, he severely fell out of his chair. <laughs> That's what, what you get what, for what's, sticking what, What's that you say, Egan? You're playing an executive order on me? Uh, he's back. Hi, oh. Egan. <laughs> what you get for sticking in the brig. Sorry, I had the call I needed to get rid no, of. No, it's okay. No worries. Oh, if, if you have an executive order, I'd be appreciative because it gets me out of sick of it, but... <laughs> uh, I do not have one, sadly. Yeah, I believe you. <laughs> It's fine. Do what do what do what you're gonna do because ultimately it'd be the same difference either way. It's just I could do something. Vladimir murder as he speaks. 
Remember, also, you have, you have quorums you can play as well. But. Well, I am going to offer Debbie a presidential pardon. Oh. Okay, so you, oh. But you move her onto any other space in the Galactica. Wow. Uh, the hangar deck. Fair enough. All right. Wow, that was kind. A kind, loving president. Never say I've never been any good for it. Infinitely suspicious. He, could have used, he didn't use yeah, that's, his, that's He could have used his Cylon detector to find that out first. That's true. He could have checked if she was a Cylon before releasing her. Yeah, I, I, I forgot I had that. <laughs> sure you did. Okay, that's fine. Uh, right, right, in in fairness, he wouldn't be able to do the same in one action unless somebody executive ordered him, so. Okay. Yeah. Um, crisis. You know, I. You know, I oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, crisis, right. Crisis. Yeah. Crisis. Crisis! You know what? I don't think there are any Cylons. I think we just abandoned them. <laughs> they all, they all ambushed us at the start and there haven't been any since. <laughs> Repair one destroyed raptor, minus one population. We or, don't have any destroyed raptor. Or roll a die if four yeah. lower minus one population. And, oh, yeah. So. If you're going for the roll, I can actually improve that to be. Um, I can improve it by one after the roll. So that'd be a free up, basically, to um, to make the roll if you want to do that. Dolce. The roll seems like the right choice. Yeah, I'll, I'll go for the roll. Okay, I can improve it by one. If somebody else can improve it by two before the roll, that'd be they're definitely guaranteed. But um, I can, but it would be using a very high uh, skill card to do it. Do we? No, no, oh, it's fine. Yeah. We, got, we, got, we got a more than 50. We've got a more than 50. It's to win some. We have plenty of population. Yeah, oh, that's true. Population is the easiest one. Also, I bet you Rise wants us to have lower population. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. <laughs> be, although, in fairness, he'd be more obvious. I want you to have high population, so please don't fail really the... Is us to have less Vipers. <laughs> yes. All right, three up. Well, four up, but, you know, if you, if you exactly roll a four, then... Six. Yeah, it's six. All right, that's fine. That's I, I didn't have to waste my card, and everything is good. Nice. All right, jump moves up. Okay. Raptors. The, the Cylons are non-existent. Draw some cards. Um, there's not really much to do. Yeah, I could it's, it's get our repaired. good friend out of. The... Yeah. Um. You could activate some vipers. <laughs> I can either draw. I could draw an engineering card, but that doesn't even seem necessary. You know what? Just because you haven't done anything too suspicious, I'll executive order you and you can get yourself out of the break. But Hooray! I'm going to move and activate two vipers. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> and if this Perfect. gets reversed instantly, I'm going to be annoyed. <laughs> All right. Crisis. Water shortage. <laughs> All right. Water shortage. Ain't it? This presidency of yours, Aegon, is being defined by our lack of resources. By no water. <laughs> oh, not another one. Are you sure you shuffled these? <laughs> so, Aegon, what, what are we doing with our water here? Oh, God. Oh, God. Let them drink I blood. Can, I can discard. I don't care. I can discard, too. <laughs> All right. It's just becoming ridiculous. It is a little ridiculous. All right, so we're discarding cards. Yes. The Cylons were a hoax by the government all along, it turns out. Absolutely. <laughs> the Cylons are not a hoax. <laughs> well, the Cylons haven't appeared forever. They all ambushed us at the start, and then... Just because you haven't seen one doesn't mean it doesn't <laughs> exist. <laughs> I don't know. I think, I think Commissar's got it right. <laughs> Just because you personally don't know anyone who suffered My treachery card. <laughs> See, that's the card. The card I just discarded is the one that you can play when someone discards a treachery card. That's yeah. I had in my hand. That's how I knew. But that's what it looks like. Okay, fair <laughs> enough. Right. Turn moves on. All right. Yep. I throw away a card? Oh, no, no, no. No, this is... it's just, just President and me. It was the yeah. President and whoever the current player was. All right, Silo. Uh oh, he's going to the crisis. He's, he's going to help us by giving us field prep. Thanks. Yep. Yep. Here we go. If somebody's got a scout on their next turn, Talon, that might well actually it won't matter for this one. Actually, no, it will matter for this one. If you've got a scout, you can play and just um, you know, that might be an idea. Crumble, 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 crumble. 
Well, doesn't he just do it right now anyway? No, because he's not a, he's not a human player right now. But it says play one of your crisis cards or draw two and choose one to resolve. No. So don't they just activate right away? Oh, fair enough. Place the ever on the bottom of the deck, and then I activate silent ship step. <sighs> so what crisis are you activating, Rise? Food shortage. <laughs> Food shortage, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> the Cylons had exactly one plan. Nuke the water ships. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to have to go outside the ship and look at the side of it. It's a tough decision for Rise because neither of them kill vipers. <laughs> oh, one does. It just has other effects I could like. <laughs> Come on, Rise. Make the decision. <laughs> I'll be nice. No, you won't. But make the decision anyway. That. <laughs> no, it's not those. I'm sorry. Stand off with Pegasus. All right, stand off wow. with Pegasus. Okay. Is this being nice? The current player may move one player no, to the brig. Not nice. To any other location, if we pass it. He just helps me fail, I think, is the point here. So, basically, anything except engineering works for this. Yep, anything but blue. Which well, is also negative. Well. <laughs> okay. She is the only negative. Alright, well, this is looking oh. good. Um, oh, wow. Rise, right, if you'd start the check. So, anything works, and so no excuses that you got nothing. <laughs> yeah. Alright, uh... We need 22, so we need a, re a few reasonable okay, cards. Too. At this point, it's me just trying to kill your hands so <laughs> I can put up the I've, I've, had enough, I've had cards gumming up my hand for quite a while, so... Yeah, I'm, I'm excited to get some of these out. <laughs> what color does treachery count as? <laughs> treachery counts Boring. as negative always. Don't play one unless you are treachery a Cylon. Bad. Also, play the cards face down so we can't see them as you add, add them to the thing. <laughs> Actually, I'd rather observe them. And you're not in the break, so you can add multiples if you want. Never say I did not do anything for you! <laughs> you didn't do anything for us. <laughs> I got your wife out of prison, so... <laughs> yes, but she could be a silent still. <laughs> well, that's your problem. That is probably my problem. This is true. <laughs> this is true. <laughs> I'm adding three. Holy shit. Are they big? Uh, one of them is big. The other two aren't. That's okay. why I'm just hedging. <laughs> Mostly, I'm just getting rid of duplicates from my hand. <laughs> Fair. I'm going to add... Hmm. Do you think we need me to add two, or are we okay if I add one big one? We currently have 11 cards in there, and the All only right. thing's I'll negative is treachery. Yeah, yeah. So I'll add one. I think that's fine. You don't want this one to fail. Rise now is just going to dump his hand in treachery All cards. Rise. How many treachery cards do you have? One good in, so... <sighs> So two randoms and ten actual cards added in before he does this. Fair enough. Right, thirteen. That means we failed. Skaven uh, logic. <laughs> Let's so see. we have a negative two. So that two, cancels that four, out. Two, four, twelve, seventeen, yeah. 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Yep. Plus another ten, thirty-five. Pass. Nice. The current yep. player may move one character to the break from any location. Oh, well, that's... Wait, is that Rise? There's nobody in the brig, so... Yeah. Right. There's From no... the brig, okay. not to the brig. From yes. the brig. Okay. So, All right. Talon's down. Talon. Alright. Draw cards. We got this. We can even FDL control if we finally actually draw... Uh, if you got a scout, I would use it. Oh, no, actually, because he put it on the bottom, didn't he? No, ignore me. No. Ignore uh, me. I am, so... I am sorry, but I do not trust the current president, so I'm going to try to get the administration Whoa. away from him. The president has done nothing but help us. Yeah, he has three... Um, I mean, you let a possible Cylon out of the bank without checking, though. 
That's true. That don't listen little... to the deception. <laughs> All right, but fine. He's going to try and make the check. So who are you passing the like present to? Myself. Of course you are. How about you give it to somebody else? <laughs> then I'm going to. Then I'm going to help this notion. Otherwise, I'm not going to. Well, you can get it if you want anyway. Of course, so I can do... see that if I want. But I obviously don't want to make sure it's not a power play from your part. I know how the games go. Uh, I trust no one. I, I, do, Actually, I don't I trust the president. <laughs> the office of the president, not Aegon in particular. Right. <laughs> but also, not Aegon. Got <laughs> something to hide. All right. Um, mm. If that's what you're doing, Destiny. Oh, actually, I'm waiting for the uh, people to put in. Mm. Uh, you need to press Destiny Start Check before that can happen. Oh, sorry. Yeah, sorry. And Destiny as well. All right. I mean, I need to compress Destiny. It's yeah, no. that's that's true. So it's a it's a check of five to allow Talon to pass the president title to himself. I'm okay. guessing you're oh. producing it right too. Vote against. Vote against. Egan, I need a presidential speech from you. Talon, I'm guessing you're producing it by two. Over the course of years. I, what? You, what you, you, have, you have the option of making this check on a free. Through space and time. Wait, how does he um, have an option? Ship of state. When a player activates the administration oh. or the breed location, yep. he may choose to reduce or increase the difficulty by two. I imagine he so wants this to pass. Three, Talon? Yeah, I'm making it easier for myself. Yep. Okay. So this passes on a free. Wow. When in the course of human events... So, Debbie, do you want <laughs> uh, Talon to be the president? Or do, are we happy with Egan? Who did get what? you out of jail. <laughs> Basically... Want Talon. Yeah. Let nobody say that this presidency was not a peaceful one! <laughs> Let nobody remember! The brave stand at the gates of the dockyard! Egan, um, you're going to no. ask Debbie just so I explain the rules and um, implications of this for Debbie. So, Debbie, this check is so that Talon can take the presidency away from Egan. Means he has access to all his car quorum cards and things. Gotcha. So it's whether you want to add cards to this or reduce it or whatever. Successful is um, politics and leadership, which are two things you don't have, but you can add cards in to make this fail. <laughs> yeah, green and yellow are the only good ones here. I see. But if you don't want this to succeed, you're adding cards, so you don't want this to succeed. <laughs> Remember the good how peaceful times. it was the good during times. our time. <laughs> and he basically takes his whole hand. And... Yeah, right. <laughs> he only needs One. three, and presumably not all of those are anti votes. Two. All right, and uh, done. Okay. Layout. He needs a free total on yellow and green. Yeah. Let's see what he's got. And. Oh no! Oh wait, it's looking okay. Oh yeah, he got it. <laughs> right? 4, 8, 13, 11, 10, 8, 6, 4. Wow, only by one, but yes, he got it. Yep, okay. All hail the new president. No! no. I refuse! <laughs> the voice wait, is it's yellow and green? That was one... That was under. Oh, I'm going to pause on my that screen was right only, now. That was only one. What that was that not No, you failed. Oh. Did we add wrong? What? I'm, I'm just waiting yeah, for it to clear up. Hold on. Sorry, it's, it's being really annoying on my screen. Um, This this is this is important. So. <laughs> oh right, you have. Wait, how are you checking? Uh, I'm I'm obviously streaming this. So. Oh, you're gonna check the stream. Okay. Unfortunately, I've lowered my link for this. Hold on. Recount, 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 <laughs> recount, recount. Yes, 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 Agan. We're recounting. We call elections. Hold on. Here, hold on. I can look as well. Thanks, thanks, thanks. Uh, I assure you, you will have Not Taylor Joe stick around once more. Gonna... Is um, Paul? Oh, only by one, but yes, he got. All right, hold on. Oh, damn it! I'll be 
Damn it, I'm not focusing enough on it. Oh okay, no! So, negatives, oh, we yeah, have... Okay. Oh, yeah, can... Why is it playing the really terrible quality? Hold on. It's okay, so you're just right, adding so green and yellow as for positive. We have negative two, six... Um, yeah, so negative two, three, five, um, eight... So negative of 12 and a positive of... 13. 13. So it does fail. So it does fail. You are not the yeah, president. Right. Oh, well. Yay! Clearly Cylons would be better at counting, so I think that's um, exonerated you. <laughs> says, I promise I will not take ill view of my opponents. <laughs> sure you won't. But I'm throwing you into the brig the moment I get a chance. <laughs> All right, crisis Talon. Crisis from Talon, then. Hangar accident. Hangar accident. Uh, oh, damage actually... vipers. Just for just for right. Okay, so. He's gonna have a crisis of self confidence. All right, so population loss potentially, and also viper loss. Oh, bloody hell. Let's start the check. Start the check. Uh, I am pretty much out of cards for this. But... Yeah. <laughs> but I'm going to use up a really good card because I don't want Rise to have these damaged vipers. <laughs> <laughs> you realize that is a human objective, right? <laughs> yes, but if it's I'm, I'm anti you right now. <laughs> Rise is different, and thus we hate him. Absolutely, <laughs> he could have chosen. He could have chosen a second pilot. He decided to play the dodgy character. <laughs> so blue, red, purple. For the check. Also, somebody disconnected from the thing. Or reconnected. I can't work out. Um. Yeah, this is into. This is entirely too. Um, <laughs> No, I don't have anything. Red. Well, you I would have if there wasn't an extraordinary election caused by somebody. <laughs> Look, I mean, you're the one who wrote the terms of office. I mean, it's not your fault that it happens all the time. Or will happen all the time from now on. <laughs> Three counts. Okay, this time we need a 10. We have minus 5 somebody's put in. Uh, so 1, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So that counters that, that, so it's two. that. So it fails. No, that's, that's 8, no. 10, 14. We need 10. Minus what? Yeah, but two fives cancel each other out. These cancel. Right. These cancel. Right. These right. cancel. Oh, oh, it's yeah, yeah. yeah. the two. Fair enough. So it's a miserable failure. Of, wow. Yeah. Okay. Fine. Damage two vipers. Lose another population point. We do, however, move up the jump counter. All right. Rise. You're. Are you happy now? I mean, I'm, the first thing we do is not <laughs> All right. Uh, Debbie's turn. So. Uh, draw your I need up. two more in that box. <laughs> uh, draw your cuts. Like this, but it's not. Oh, there was an on top of it, I guess. Yep, that's fine. Just to annoy Rise, you're in the hangar deck. If you have the ability to prepare two vipers, be <laughs> please down. <laughs> it it would amuse me so much. <laughs> But honestly, do, do what you want to do here. But honestly, we do have two damaged vipers. We could be with those online. <laughs> I mean, it's almost like you have four more functional in the reserves and two it's more in It's almost like space. you care about us having damaged vipers. <laughs> it's almost like I care so I can help the humans win. It's almost like you're trying caring so you can win. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I could win, just not with humans. You could do I'm that. I'm trying to make it that so would, I have the option. Least, that would at least be definite. And therefore, you know, then we would definitely be against you. As it happens, I'm against you purely because it's ambiguous. <laughs> but 
Okay, hey nice. guys, I hope you don't mind if I start destroying you just to spite Shadow now. Absolutely. Um, if you play a repair from the hangar deck, you can actually repair two vipers. Yeah, but then can I launch myself into a viper? No, you can't, but you might as well. You can launch yourself if you want to do that instead. Can't do both? You get one action, so. Oh, can anybody but launch What you? makes me annoyed at you, Debbie? You will repair the vipers. Um, in theory, I think. You don't yeah. want me annoyed at you. Um. Okay, so um, just to answer Ryze's question, um, Egan's question here, I think yes, you can, but you don't have any piloting abilities, so. Oh, uh, yeah. So, uh, you must have a piloting skill in your selection of cards to launch yourself in a vape. Oh, okay. Fair oh. Enough. So, no, you can't. But I'm if... going to go ahead and repair vipers. <laughs> uh... <laughs> I love you, my dear. Just say. I don't know if that was optimal, but I love you anyway. <laughs> Alright, uh, Destiny deck? Uh, crisis deck, sorry? That I have nothing to fly around in. Destiny. Uh, sorry, the Crisis, crisis. cards. Ah. Oh. Um, yes, we play all of them. That's definitely going to be disastrous. Rise would be happy. The Olympic Carrier. Okay. Okay, so piloting. Um, Piloting leadership and politics, morale loss and population loss if we fail this, and morale is kind of critical, so we need to at least get eight. Uh, Debbie, if you stop check. Uh, I'm adding a low card to this, unfortunately. Everything but blue and purple. Yep. If you want this to succeed. Anything else if you want it to fail. Whoops. Well, that keeps happening. Where this is on top of my draw button, so I keep hitting the draw button. <laughs> yeah. Go your camera so it's not on top of it. Fair. <laughs> How much do we have in there already? Uh, we have five cards currently. Two from Destiny, one from me, which is quite low. I think Aegon added one, and I think... Uh, I did one. Yeah. yeah. I'll put in one then. Yes, although we have people who are actively working against us, which I think we have proof of at this point. So who knows? Right, seven. Yeah, I don't think we would have failed that huge check if that was not the case. So, minus one, minus seven. Who put in two cards? Put in one. No, we all put in one. I put some like um, definitely deck there too. Hmm. Nine minus seven? Two. Nine minus eight, two. Yep, so minus, minus one, one morale, yeah. minus one population. Oh. But. We begin the jump phase. Hey, I got it. All right, Admiral, draw two cards. Wow, this one again. We lose all the vipers that I spent ages trying to redeploy. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, how do you, you guys know, feel about our fuel? We're fine on fuel. Yeah, more yeah, fuel. Fuel is a okay. Would you rather jump further? Yes, absolutely. Loot... Get us get us close to the victory. Yes, we need to get jump further. It also means Prefer... if, you, if we jump further, we have more chances of getting cars that actually jump us to wait. Okay. Preferably... There you go. Oh! Convoy, convoy. Lose free fuel, gain one population. The Admiral may choose to lose one morale to gain one fuel. Admiral, what do we feel about this? Oh... Um... I'm going to choose to not lose the morale, I don't think. <laughs> okay, good. So we have now traveled a total of seven. We just need one more jump. One yeah, more jump? Two no, more. Two, two more jumps, but now any two jumps will do. Yeah. Oh, wait, so the set, we so no matter how much distance we go on this next jump, we yeah. still have Once to Once we do get one to eight, jump. we okay. must jump again. So, But it means okay. any card gets us to eight now. Cool. So even if we get unlucky with a double one, we still make it. So, hooray. What if we get two? Well, two doesn't matter. As long as we're beyond eight, we can jump again. So, as I say, oh. any card does it now. So, that was Debbie's turn, right? Please, uh, crisis. Yes. No, so we, that was crisis. that was the crisis. No, that was the crisis. Oh, that was. Uh, yes. Yeah. So, so it's now, now it's uh, my turn. Yeah. Right. Draw set.
I haven't gotten to kill anyone yet, and I'm pretty disappointed about it. I'm just going to say that. I think it's getting to the point where we probably want to start killing some people. Unfortunately, somebody has to repair the Admiral's quarters. Yeah, it's currently in disarray. <laughs> uh, right. Who's got some repairs? I got nothing. I, well, don't. I can actually see you have nothing. I don't have any more repairs. Fair enough, fair enough. I am going to, therefore, for my action... Because I've given up trying to deploy Vipers. It never works. Uh, I'm going to go for a Raptor Scout. Since the destination date doesn't really matter except for the potential badness of that, I'm just going to have a look at the top crisis card. Just have uh, okay, so this actually doesn't cause us any problems, so I'm going to keep it on top. Um, Agen, I apologize. Uh oh. So um, I flip the top card of the Crisis deck, which is. Oh, God. Requested resignation. <laughs> Either the president <laughs> must give it to the Admiral or move to the. I mean. I mean. <laughs> Admiral? I'm, of course, going to make the president reside. <laughs> president, they choose to. <laughs> Would you like to make me the president, or would you like to go to the brig and make uh, Tom Zarek the president, actually? He the keeps the presidency. Oh, he does? Yeah, president to the yeah. admiral, so... Oh, it's only if the admiral is placed in the brig that it changes, I see. Mm -hmm. Okay, so either you go to the brig and keep the presidency, or you give me the presidency. <laughs> oh, boy. I, like, I apologize, but... It, this didn't cause us any problems, so... Well, it didn't cause me any problems. <laughs> but I felt that was better uh, than a random. I will hand over the presidency, but I will contest it. <laughs> the good news is, I then I can now declare martial law to make you president again. Yes, thank you. Double press. So, wait, his quorum cards in his hand go into my hand? Yes. Yep, yep they do. Okay. So you find out all the useful decisions he's not been actioning. All the things he hasn't been doing. I'll let you guys know. Let's see. Yep. Oh. I don't think you, well, you shouldn't reveal them anyway. All right. Um, to? Over to Agen. Yeah. Okay. Right. Nothing Nothing too bad. <laughs> he wasn't hiding secret stores of ice cream? Not really. Okay, good. Agen? Are you okay, I'm 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 right away, then. I shall move my. You want to draw cards first, Agen? I, I shall draw my cards. <laughs> Given you have none. <laughs> Former uh, President Agen. I shall move myself to the Admiral's quarters, but I shall do use the Cylon Detector on the current Admiral President. He'll ah. have a pouty face the Once per game, he may look at all the loyalty cards belong to one player. So, yep. Face down and... Yeah. Into my you hand. May... Yes. You may observe my loyalty cards. You're gonna make a face the whole time. So, Aegon knows. But Aegon has that... three of them, so he's more likely to be silent himself before this yeah. begins. This is where the conundrum now begins. Gentlemen, we must remove the president. <laughs> well, one of the two is a, uh, is a silent then. <laughs> yeah, now yeah, we know. One of those two is now definitely absolutely a silent. So, it's good we move the presidency at least. Well, I don't know. Maybe it's, it's not. bad that we moved the presidency. Very, very bad. And considering one of the quorum cards, it's even worse. Okay. Um, Draw your crisis card. Draw your crisis card, and then disaster's about to occur, I think. One attack. Civilian, Civilian ship nuked. President chooses. All right, I think we will probably. Hold on, I have to. Hold on, I have to choose my card, don't I? Yeah, you get yeah, to. Choose, yes. you, get, you do get to buy the card. Oh. Mm -hmm. If you can go for an engineering repair, I can probably do something on my turn. Wow, both of these are awful. Oh yeah. Yeah. I also don't know what the uh, silent would do on this one. This, the the silent would do either. We <laughs> get jump it, at least. Uh, I think for fear of giving Cylons more power by giving them treachery cards, we're going to draw two civilian ships and destroy them. Okay. Uh, shuffling the civilian ships. Draw, them, draw the things that are about to die. 
Two population. Free, Free population. population. No problem, really. Yeah, that's yeah, like the best case I scenario mean, for us. That's not a problem for us at all, is it? <sighs> okay, fine. All right. The no, president is a silent. We did have, we do have a jump and have a point up the board, and it might be an yeah. idea to start rushing this while we have population still to burn. <laughs> all right, president admiral. Yes. It is your turn. Hello, my citizens. Um... He is a Cylon. Or well, Aegon's a Cylon. I will play Arrest Order and send Aegon to the brig. He is a Cylon. Don't forget to draw your cards. Yeah, draw your cards. Oh, thank you. Aegon has been brigged. Wait, why did I only draw one? What was that? Did I click uh, the wrong button? You no, press draw one. Yep, that's fine. That'll work. I repeat, the president is a silent. Oh, sorry. Uh, to play that, I will play... Eh, actually, no, it's fine. That'll just be my one action. We're good. Okay. All right. So, um, yeah, movement if you wanted to. I mean, you kind of... I out of order, but, you know. will not move. I'm good. All right. Um, and we crisis. will crisis. Is that on We're tracking rapture. device? Oh, okay. Hey, the silent might actually appear. <laughs> and you can destroy one rafter just for our friend. <laughs> oh, no, rafter. You care about vipers. Never yeah, mind. Apparently he cares about vipers. All right. Um, so it's 10. All right. All right, 10 up. Play the oars. I'll assume that's a no. What'd you say? Sorry? Is there any way before it's going to be played? Doesn't look oh, like it, uh, unless anybody no. else wants to interfere with us. No. Our raptors just ships. Raptors are our scout ships, so they're the ones that are sort of finding out what the crisis card is ahead of time that I'm using occasionally. Yeah. All right, so this is a check on um, all three of your skills, actually. Um, tactics, piloting, Engineering. Okay. And there's very little discussion going on about what people are ad apparently adding. But, um, <laughs> but it's fine. Okay, I'm going to add one, which is reasonable. I was extra reasonable. I don't know about that. Again, you can have <laughs> one card because you're in the break. Yeah, I can. What can I add? Well, you can add anything, uh, but tactics, piloting, and repair are probably, um, <laughs> probably the order of so the day. So blue. Blue for you. <laughs> Blue for you, indeed, if you want to. Nah. Wow. That sounds like a Cylon who doesn't care. I am not a Cylon. <laughs> I'm just oh, saying. It sounds like a Cylon who doesn't care. Oh, God. Mm, I the saw that. Cylon. Wait. Mm, I saw that. Wait, why are these... No, something went weird because I had... Wait, is this, like, stacked now? Hold on. Is this two cards? No. no. This is one card. What the heck? Something weird happened. I think I tried to drag two cards in at the same time and it blew. Ah, there we go. Okay, okay, okay. I figured it out. All right. I'll add two cards. Of course, that masks your um, definite not attempt to put a green in there. Oh, look. There's a ton of green in here. <laughs> Fail. Oh, wow, that definitely failed. Yep. And I know what I added, so. Um, yeah. I did not add anything. Let oh, it be noted. Absolutely. So, um, so we destroy a raptor. Yep, we lose a raptor. We have a base star in front and two civilian ships at the back. We haven't had like any ships around us like this whole game. I know. Yes, this, this during my game. presidency. I know. <laughs> and now it's over. It's um, it's fine. Okay. Rise then. Yeah, do do do. It's funny how we start getting Cylons. Uh, do we get a rap? 
Do we get a um, Raptor deployment here? Raider deployment? It only says deploy base. Uh, there's no Raiders when that activates, then to spawn fair base. Oh, okay. Fine. That's fine. All right. All right. And do those have to attack at the end of my turn? Well, the Raiders? No, they they run automatedly, so they, that's just them deploying. Then they go and start doing things. Oh, so we don't... Oh, right. right. It only activates when the symbol is there at the bottom yep. or something, right? Okay. Yeah, yeah. The I symbols see. determine how the Raiders go. We've had so few ships, I haven't had to learn that rule at all. <laughs> <laughs> no, you, you should learn when we had the entire board filled up with things and we decided to oh, leave. Oh, I care. I just used my ability and we left, so it's fine. <laughs> yep. I tried to use my ships and I got stuck in the brig. <laughs> Uh, Debbie, right. yeah. it's worth remembering that you have a once per game ability that might become relevant soon. Just saying that we might want to start making. Oh, just use choose of the that. result of a crisis card. Interesting. Yeah. Which might be relevant to certain things happening. We'll see. <laughs> Although, if it's a super crisis played by our friend, then it doesn't matter. Because you can't use character abilities. You all get to just get two skill cards. Oh, because you, you just choose. Okay. Yeah, which is fine. So each of us discards two. Wow, we're all discarding one point executive orders. <laughs> I apparently have a lot of. Yes, because somebody spent them all. <laughs> Past turn. All right, De uh, Talon. Talon. Um, right. I think we need you to be president right now. Uh, but we'll see how you do this. Minute. The president and admiral must be stopped. <laughs> That's Miss President Admiral to you. Yes, you are a Miss President. You're in the break. You know, I don't think you can talk in the break. He can talk. He can shout. I... <laughs> Nobody knows the <laughs> troubles I've seen. <laughs> Nobody knows my sorrow. Um, let's see. Debbie? Yes, Ambassador Scroob. It would be really helpful if you could activate the Admiral's location on your turn in some way, shape, or form. Admiral's location? Admiral's quarters and get that back online. Alright, I will try to, to claim the presidency from... The lovely Admiral Presidente. Excuse me. Okay, so Administration 5, are you going to make that easier on yourself? Yes. Okay, good. All right, Destiny. And start check. No, Debbie, you have the option of just making this pass. Oh, that's Crisis Card. No, you can't do this. No, sorry, ignore me. Yep. So this is um, politics and... Um, Leadership. Two skill <laughs> cards you have none of uh, for this check. Yeah, mine's crisis card. How's the Destiny deck looking, Rise? He's not even being subtle about it anymore. Well, I'm just curious. I, what, whether I have a solid <laughs> or not, I want to be president. Oh, which one are we doing now? We're doing this one. The As Egan demonstrated. Uh, no, we're doing a we're doing a change of presidency because we don't like the current president. Um, Administration action. Indeed. So basically, it's any politics or um, leadership cards. You shouldn't have any in your hand, though. It's not that. It's um, this. Yeah. Which ones? It's that we're resolving right now. But you, you shouldn't have any of those type of cards. No, I don't have any. So okay. unless you want to vote against this, you should pass. I mean, I could always give it back to him. <laughs> but I want it gone. It's true. You can Agen can put right one there. card um, into there. One card in. One. Holding? Uh, yeah. Hagen, uh, why are you bothering? We. Wait, why do you, what? Why'd you flip it face up? Oh, sorry. Oh, buddy. I mean, that's definitely an accidental, definitely not at all uh, masking the truth flip. I'm gonna add three cards. Oh, and yeah. I didn't accidentally flip that one up either. No, of course, of course you didn't. 
course he didn't. <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> Let's see what Rise wants from this. I mean, if Rise wants the humans to win, it's looking the right path to help us at the moment. I think I can. I mean, somebody. I, think the have way too many vipers. <laughs> I mean, you know, I I just did that to annoy you. Who knows? <laughs> All right. All right. I doubt this works, but you never know. Use a low threshold. Boom. Uh, let's see. Minus five. That's a minus. That's all Three minus. Yellow. So it's it's just it's just positive six. Minus seven. Yeah, it's already done. Minus another five. Minus four. Yeah, it's like a negative a million. Good news is that's getting things out of their hand. Or eleven. Yeah. Oh. And we know somebody added three cards to that, and it's not his turn for a while, so I'm actually reasonably happy with that result. Crisis. Oh, yeah, um, let's see. We celebrate Coronation Day now. Or what, what was the thing called? Water, water sabotaged. God All damn right. it, no wonder we're running out of water. Current player chooses. <laughs> we can either do a check where we will lose two food, or we can take one food loss. Either way, the jump tracker moves and the raiders make a move. It's a lot of five food. I can't uh, help with that. I'd almost say it's worth just taking it. I mean, we have Debbie who can just automatically pass it, but this doesn't seem like a critical one for that. You think we should just lose the food? Yeah, I hate to do it, but um, I'll take the food. Yep, I'm agreeing with that. What do you think, Pestin Jail? <laughs> Sorry. I think sorry. Okay, fine. We're losing the food. <laughs> All right. All right. Okay, and then the what happens? The, the raiders then move clockwise towards the, towards the nearest civilian ships, so they go. Oh, I see. Okay. To there. There's basically a priority order on what they do. So they'll attack a Viper if there's one in the area. They'll then attack a civilian ship. They'll then move clockwise towards the nearest civilian ship. And if there are no civilian ships, they'll attack the Galactica. I see. Where do we have active raiders? Uh, yeah, we have a couple of active raiders up here. But... Have a card that can um, that can uh, negate them. They're not attacking right now. Uh, it's just before they're activated. Play before raiders are activated. The first four raiders. It doesn't work. Activated. It does not work like that, Debbie. It doesn't work. Nope. That's fine. They're not close enough to matter anyway. No, he needs a couple yeah. more activations for the threatening our civilian ships. Okay. And should I be, be able to play the card in response, or do I have to have it out already? I mean, you can play a card if, in response if you want, but Rise is saying it doesn't do what you think it does, I think. You have to be in space for it to work. If it's a pilot card, you have to be in space, yeah. Yeah, but it doesn't say that I have to be in my ship. It says run interference. Piloting. That's the title. It does not work like that, Debbie. All right. Uh, it is, however, your turn now, Debbie. Okay. So, draw your cards. What instances do we roll dice in, by the way? To attack, to um, when the cards ask you to. Okay. There's, there's various dice rolls that have been going on throughout the game, so... Okay. Um, why do you want me to put someone in the brig? No, we want you to repair the Admiral's quarters um, so we can put somebody else in the brig. Right. Oh, okay. The Admiral, specifically, but... Yeah, of course. But, you know, he needs his quarters back, so we can do that. Okay. So, so, move, and are you playing a repair? Uh, actually, I don't have a repair. Oh, don't right. do that. If you, can't, if you don't have a repair, don't move there. Um, if you don't, the probably best move for us to do is just move a viper so you can go and protect the civilians. Launch a viper? Yeah. 
Well, she that's can different. go out into space. Yeah, that's what I mean. She can go out. She gets one extra move, so she can move into a couple of the civilian ships. <gasps> oh, yeah. Okay, so where's the stuff for the Vipers? If, if that's what you're doing. Yep. Okay, so there you go. You have your Viper, and you get one additional action, which is going to be to move the Viper, I imagine. Because they have to fight, they have to fight you before they fight the civilian ships. So moving into sector with the civilian ships is a reasonable play for right now. Moving to intercept these raiders. Yeah, but well you move to into the civilian ships, so they have to attack you before they can kill our resources. They're going counterclockwise. No, they're going clockwise. Clockwise, okay. Yeah. How far can I move? One. So you move into the backspace. Gotcha. If that's what you want to do. I'm just checking my cards. Okay. Mm -hmm. Are the the raiders Cylon ships? Yes. Okay. Uh, can I play a card as a action? Let me move anywhere and engage one of them yeah that'll be that'll be better if you want to do that so you move to any uh any space area so presumably that one have to be in the square with them yeah you have to they're totally attacking them in the same place and then you get what you may attack one cylon ship in your area so that's the dice roll and you need a three plus to destroy a raider one second <coughs> Your dice is right in front of your player thing. Uh, can I play another card? As long as it's not an action, you can play it. Yeah. yeah it's not an action. Okay. Uh, I'm going to automatically add two to my dice roll, whatever it comes out. Okay. So you just automatically kill it. Right. Yeah, so you automatically yeah. kill it. You probably. Nah, that's fine. I need a four or higher, you said? No, you needed a three or higher, but now you have a one or higher, so you don't have to roll. All right. Uh, Crisis Coffee 10. I roll? Well, no, you lose that so you didn't have to. You automatically destroyed it. I only got two from could... that card, though. Yes, but that means yeah, you, you are rolling a one, one, or, one or better now, so you don't need to roll. I... You need you needed a three or more on the dice, but now you need a one or more. So you've killed it. So we move on to Crisis. Because no matter what you roll, you get a one or more. The card say that? You added two to your dice roll, so it would automatically kill it. That's what I thought you did. So, yeah. So you that, need three or higher yeah. normally. You now need one. And you added two. Yeah, I'm supposed to roll and get one or higher. But you're going to roll uh, yes. one of the dice regardless, so we don't need to do that. Yeah. <laughs> Crisis down, man. I get it now. My brain is slow and foggy. It's fine. So now I do what? Crisis? Uh, Crisis, which I'm just revealing. So, uh, mandatory testing. Oh, dear God. All right, fine. Um, so. Oh. Yeah, so this is a um, leadership politics check of 13. If this passes, the president looks at one random loyalty card of one I point. can help us out, yeah. Yeah, I bet that would help us out a great deal. It will. Uh, start check, we? if you would. Thank you. Okay. Uh, unfortunately, I have neither card of either type, and I don't. The want important to thing is that we don't lose morale. No, you, or, or no, I guess we're just losing morale. I guess Probably are just to. losing morale with this. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Unless you've you've got a hand that says thirteen. <laughs> I, um... uh, I'm not going to waste cards on this. I'm sorry. Yeah. 
Hmm. I don't have anything to help. Well, at least we find All out right. what Rise added in, most likely. <laughs> Whatever it was, it was a bad one. Oh, no, no, wait, it could have been know. a good one. Could have been a good one. Who knows? But it was a random one. But, so yeah, I reckon so there's more chance that Rise is disrupting the game, which is probably fair. Yep. Okay. All right. My turn, then. Yep. Draw. Uh, since Debbie's now in position, I don't necessarily have to worry about deploying things at this point. Downside is, I can't really do a lot. Um, let's just have a think about this. How far... We are at FTL control. I could just go and use that. Alternatively... <laughs> Thinking, sorry. Um, we have six population. I think it's worth pushing the button right now. Push the button. It's number one. Just away. a note if you take in go to zero population due to jumping, you lose. It says at the end of a turn. This is what we had the discussion with last time. I disagreed with it. Are you sure it's that way around? I'm sure. Fair enough. Doesn't matter. Right. Still doing it. All right. I am pressing the big old FTL button. Okay, so I'm looking at the things then? Doing the normal Admiral nope, I have, thing? We have to ch first off, I have to check to see whether I kill anybody with this. However, I am going to play a strategic planning. So this is a 5-up now rather than a 7-up. Oh, this is a roll. Yeah. yeah. If I pass, Four. No. I did not. We lose three population from this. Okay. How many, how many did you lose by? I uh, lost by one, if you can increase it by I one. Have a card that can help. Yay! Okay, we didn't. Wow. Nice. nice. Okay. Debbie, <laughs> not a Cylon. <laughs> yeah, no, we knew, we knew that. All right, so everybody yeah. now returns back to um, the thing. Not a Cylon, but I'm still. Uh, his Debbie, uh, I think, okay. appears in any position she wants, but Hanger Dick probably makes sense. She goes back to Hanger. Right, based well, on... I'm just saying, there's one Cylon between Aegon and I. Then, if Debbie's not a Cylon, that means there's only we two people. We know you're the Cylon! <laughs> there's only two people left who can be the other Cylon. We know you're the Cylon already. I'll get back in the. You don't know. Oh, because we, we've moved, me. so all the Vipers go Draw your and destinations. Now. So yep. draw destinations and choose one. Well, we'll find out when you decide to pick the um, the terrible one, even though clearly we have better options. Um, well, one of these is not bad, and one of these is real bad. <laughs> Actually, they're both real bad. That Just means kidding. one of them is win the game. The other one, one of them, we we get the the, the number anyway. But you know, it's probably going to be a free with a really bad negative effect. Uh, are you sure we yeah. get the number anyway? Um, uh, misjump. No, we're at, um, yeah, okay, fair enough. Oh, my. So, you're definitely a Cylon. Draw a civilian ship to destroy. Yep. I've never seen that one before. So, we lose a population. And then you draw a new destination card to resolve. Yeah, the mispressing. Only one. Yep, go for it. The mispressing oh has misjumped. He's already drawn it for you. You oh. only draw one. Oh, okay, sick. Boop. All right, lose one fuel. The admiral may risk one raptor to um, to potentially gain some more fuel. Yeah, well, you won't. Yeah, of course we won't because it's not because we not as if we have spare raptors here. <laughs> uh, why would we move the raptor? Because it says otherwise destroy one. Okay. If you roll a one or a two. Oh, uh, I understand. Yeah, we I, we won't risk it though. It's not worth it. Of course it's not worth it. I mean, it's only the end of the game and a new thing we could have done to try and help ourselves out, but, you know. Um, did we lose all the... Uh, Alright, so... Progress? Uh, yeah, all the progress goes out to zero, and I draw my crisis card for the turn then, I think. Um, mm hmm oh, I was thinking about doing something here, but we'll, we'll hold off. Um, Wait, how are we at five population? I thought we were at six and then we lost three. No, we and didn't. We, just we didn't because Debbie right, played a card that increased that. Oh, that's right. That's right. That's right. Good. All right, medical breakthrough. Oh, not bad. Okay, so um, this seems absolutely fine. Each human player draws a skill card. Everybody except Rise, so I'm always up for that. 
anything that we want? Um, yeah, color. pop um, yellow, green, and blue. 12 needed. Starting with Aegon, who can put one card in if he wants. Yellow, green, blue. Oh, only if we pass it. Yeah, if we pass it, we draw a card. If we get a 6+, plus, no effect. I cannot help or hurt. Of course. You know, we, we know which one you were trying to do. So we only need to jump one more time to win the game. Two more. Uh, no, we moved another position, so that is eight. Oh, we moved on? I, thought, I didn't think we moved that one. The misjump still draws another, so yeah, it's... Yeah, another move. one, so we still got to eight. Oh. Yeah, so we, are, we, are, we are one jump from victory. But we are also three morale away from losing, and two Cylon reveals puts us at one morale, right? Not yeah, assuming they're not in the break. Unless they're breaks, which is true. Yeah, or someone saves us by adding morale. Anyway, Debbie, what would you like to put in? Yeah, yellow, green, or blue. The only things would be blue from you, most likely. I don't know if the skill of this card will be counted towards this. If it's a treachery card, it doesn't add to it, so... No. Uh... It doesn't matter what the card says. It's, it's a, like, the only the thing that matters is the number matter and the color. Case, all that matters is the number and the color, yeah. Well, it's about adding... Uh, it says to play before cards are added to a skill check. Uh, right, we, but you can ignore that and just play it as a skill card for the yeah. number at if, the top. If you meant to play it beforehand, uh, we've now added cards to the deck, so that's we've lost the chance for that, but remember that for later. Oh. I'm just wondering if the second part of it counts. No, the... no, because if it says it must be played before skill cards are put in, then it had to be played beforehand. We put skill cards yeah. in now. All right, well... Mm. It still helps, at least. Fair enough. And uh, you know what I'm going to put in. Something that might actually mean we actually pass one of these checks for the first time in forever. Layout. No. That's bad. Fair enough. Okay. Ten cards. Ten minus... More than enough to put you to the fail. Yeah. So, might one morale, and each player discards one skill card, draws one treachery card. It failed. Here. We got. Um... Wait, did we pass? No, we failed oh, completely. Oh. Okay, so we just card a. We lost yeah. the morale. Do we lose our morale? Yeah, morale no. down. Oh, morale will be at two. Yes. And then discard a skill card and draw a treachery card. Okay, and then we move to Aegon's turn after that one. Drawing the set. Draw a treasure card. Okay. This needs reshuffling. Uh, yeah. yeah. Um, treachery. Uh, which ones? Treachery is down here, yeah. bottom left. I request help in getting out of the brig. I'd love to help you. I'm going to make it harder. Uh, Talon, making it harder. Well, then I won't get out of the brig. It's, it's, still, okay. it's still worth the check. It's the only thing you can do right now. Yeah. Right? If, if uh, nothing else... By two. So it's a nine. Yeah, if nothing else, um, it's getting cards out of their hands to prevent it because I have enough cards to make it successful. So. Okay, I'm getting out of the brig. So then, do your thing. Destiny skill check for you. Yeah, start um, the check. Um, I will... Put everything I have. Medical breakthrough. He's doing the big check. Yeah, this is um, yellows and purples. He did also reveal he put a green in, so, you know. Yeah, I'm pretty obvious at this point. Medical thing. We just did that. No, this we now has doing no a effect. Check. Doing what? We're doing the break. Oh. Oh, whether or not to get Egan out. Yeah. Right. Which is yellow and purple. Yellow and purple. Sorry, I don't have any of the colors to help. All right, Egan. Given that we're probably a negative, um, a negative thirteen. Yep, I'm gonna pass. <laughs> 
Aiken's gonna try. No, uh, no, wait, I can get. Oh, right. I only one card for Aiken. Oh, yeah, Aiken can only There's only one card me. anyway, but I would actually wait. Okay, but do I wait or do I. Uh, it's probably worth waiting. Alright. Well, that was a useless group of cards, but hey, we got some of them out of the hand. Fail. Okay. Crisis. Oh, no. No, 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 no crisis. crisis. Egan says My no turn. crisis. Yeah, off we go. All right. I'll be right back. No worries. Um, Keep playing. Um... Hmm. I will use my I will move what color am I? Yellow? Your cards. I'll move to the president office. Scout a card for that, but also add cards yep. to your hand first. Oh yeah, right, I get to draw. That's cool. Um, did this change anything? No. Um, okay. I'll discard the scout and move there, and then I'll take the president's office action. Yeah, draw a quorum, and then you may draw an a quorum. We'll play one. Okay. Politicians, you. Um, so, if we, on our final jump to win, a resource goes to zero, do we still win? No. Um, that was a no? It is a no. Depends which side you are. Okay. I'm going to play assigned mission specialist. I'm assuming no food for humans is bad. But you also don't draw a destination card, so. Oh, you don't? No. Nope. But nice of you to oh. know. Nice of you to do that. Well, then never mind. Uh, uh. Hmm. Well, I might as well. I think I'll just draw. Yeah. All right. We'll do it anyway. And I'll give. Uh, I'll draw two politics cards. And give them two. Oh, there. there. Give this card. What? And give, give this card. Jack. To my good buddy Talon. Oh, that's so sweet of you. You're welcome. You get no additional abilities. <laughs> All right, and then we can do a crisis. Okay. All right, can I play it, Jesus? Uh, I don't see it. Um, yeah, I think we're going to do. The... I don't see the card. It's a the crisis. Yeah, I see that. Uh, oh, no, my not okay. reunite the fleet. Yes. All right. Uh, let's do. Hmm. Let's do the check. Debbie, do you want to just make us pass this check? Let me see. Actually, this isn't that critical in all honesty, but it does prevent them getting a lot of treachery cards. I mean. It also prevents you going to morale one. It also does prevent us going to morale one, so this probably is worth us doing. Uh, yeah, we'll pass this one. Yep, passed. Plus more population. Plus more okay. And now it's Rise's turn. Let me know. Well, I see, I it's gonna be a close game. Yes, definitely. Mm, we'll see. Would appreciate if we could finish it in twenty minutes. Ah, uh, we'll see. Possible, but if we take our turns relatively quickly, I think we definitely will. Well, it depends on how many jump preps come up, I guess. <laughs> One less now.
do, 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 do. Kind of wish I did a new cap, a new cap again now. <laughs> All right. You're welcome, humans. <laughs> Sounds like dog it. fight. Like okay. Viper, this one's really interesting. This stays back. in play because it makes more shit oh. spawn whenever we activate raiders. Uh, keeps that until these jump on no raiders remain on the board. Each time raiders are activated, launch two raiders from each base there. Okay. Okay. Turn Talon. Alrighty, I shall draw my cards. Yeah, I don't really like these cards, so I shall set up a bomb inside the Galactica. Fair oh. enough. Uh, if you're not in the brig, you may draw up to five galactic damage tokens. Holy. Choose two. Oh, and discard. Choose two. Okay. Okay. One, two, three, four. One more. Oh, four? All right. Five, and then five. you pick two. Let's see. What do we have to decide uh, here? You got FTL control, armory, food loss, command, and fuel loss. I think FTL is something we should definitely put, right? Mm-hmm. What? Yes. What'd you say? And, and then... Uh, do, do, do. And then probably loss. fuel loss. Um, yeah, I'll go losing a fuel too. And um, I knocked down our. Yeah, if I only had a hanger deck, that'd be nice too. Oh well. It's fine. Shall... Uh, so discard your. Um, actually, what's the full process for this, guys? So now he has to do the other Cylon activation things, right? Yeah. And just go down to three cards. Yeah. Uh, just give me a moment to. I shall discard. Hopefully into a pile here. One, two, three. One, two, uh, three. And I shall keep the other one. And I'm down to three. Yep. And I get a super crisis for that if I get back to it. Yes. You move to the resurrection ship and then you receive one super crisis. And I get the I present. No, I don't get the present. <laughs> no, you don't. It's the other one we need to do things with. Excuse me, don't talk about me like I'm not here. I'm You're fine. Not here. I'm, You're not a person. You're I'm not a, a person. We don't believe you. Anymore. I am definitely a person. The you Cylon are, is in jail. <laughs> um, I do get to sick bait from that, don't I? Yes. Yep. Because it blew up. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah, it's double checking. All right. All right, so then no crisis, right? Because he's... Yeah. No crisis. Yeah. So, uh, Debbie, your turn. Draw cards. Debbie. Oh boy. Oh boy, 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 And I think your order of business is to get out there and start shooting some raiders, some raiders, because there's going to be a lot of them coming. You don't want me to repair the brig? Uh, at this point, it's probably not too relevant, but I am going to get Aegon out of um, there on his turn. Okay. You're going to try to. Oh no, I'm getting him out of there. All right. Because you've lost all your character abilities, so we don't have to worry about a sure. negative anymore. And also, I've got. I have cards uh, still. Uh, yeah, you have um, you have free cards. What I plan right, means so... um, there's going to be other things. All right. Let's see. Hmm. Do I? with an executive order. You basically order somebody else to have two turns. You could, if you were feeling um, crazy with it, play it on Aegon. And do two break skill checks. Yep, and see if you can sabotage both of them. The thing is, though, I'd probably wait a little bit, because obviously you put your cards in last on both checks. Actually, no, Aegon puts his cards in last on both checks, so we get to see how many cards he sabotages with each time, and then decide which one we want. Although, uh, <laughs> Talon, 
actually add first. Her Debbie adds last. It's her turn. Yeah, Debbie adds last. But no, but I would be... No, I would be... It would be Aegon taking the actions, though. That's true. So, I'm trying to but, um, but Talon can still well. increase the difficulty. No, not no, anymore. Not anymore. I He's not a person. Oh, wait, do you lose your abilities once yep, you do yeah. that? Okay. Anyway, sorry, Debbie? Does this card actually do that, though? Yeah. It it movement, it... one action. Or two actions. One... And the only and action one... Aegon can take is cards in his hand or the brick. Are there cards that say executive order at the title? Yeah, it's called executive order. It's a leadership card. I don't have one of those. The card I have says movement, take one action, only one critical situation or executive order card may be used per turn. Does this do? Okay. It lets you turn your movement into an action. Which is fine for right now because you want to be in a flight, you want to be in a ship. Um, I'm I'm asking, what does this card do? It lets you take an action instead of moving, and then you have an action left. So basically, what that does in your purposes is, is that you, instead of moving, you take the action to put yourself in a flight. You then gain one action from that, so you can then fly over to here, and then you can use your action to shoot. Alright, I'll go ahead and do that then. Yep. So instead of moving, we put you in a Viper. Yeah. Da -da -da -da. You then get a free action from the hangar movement. Which is presumably moved to deal with the two raiders at the back. repair card be any good here? No, you're now in a you're now in a ship. So you're going out there to fight the raiders, or I thought that was the plan. Right. So now you're in a ship, you don't play any more cards, you just move and well, attack. You, you can play cards, but you know, it's oh, okay. not you can't do a repair from in space. So how do I determine how many damage I do I roll? Well first off you have to move into the space. You've got two you got basically got two movements. Uh, so one of the or one move and one attack. So at this point, you'd go into there. Yep. And then you've got one attack, which is um, effectively attacking a raider is just roll a free plus on a dice and you kill it. You may have pilots and cards that allow you to do other things, though. Alright, one second. Yep. Because I know from uh, Kairos' game, he had pilot cards that allowed him to attack multiple times or re roll when he failed or other things. I would need a three plus. So the three plus to destroy a raider at the moment. 50-50. Well, actually, it's close enough. Oh, to make it an oh, yeah, sorry. All right, so we just kill a raider. Fair enough. Which is fine, and at least deals with one of them for now. All right. Crisis turn. Crisis. So, yep. crisis drawn. Unidentified ship. And Sorry. pressingly, there's base star activations, but we resolve the thing first. So, destiny and star check. We lose. Do humans lose if there's no population left? Yeah, but that's the least risky of our things at the moment. But yeah, we would lose if any of these go to zero. Where's the score of how much we have of what? Six. Left? It's the top point. right of the board. There's fuel, food, morale, and population. Population. We're low on morale. Full end of morale. I don't suppose repair cards would come in handy either. <laughs> well, you're again, you're in space, yeah. you can't repair things from in space. <laughs> uh, I mean, can you use repairs to no, fix No, the card stuff? is... Uh, sorry. You can, use, you can use them to fix stuff, but you have to be back on the ship. 
Yeah. Yeah. It's more, so important. It's more important to do Unless you have any before checks, let's start the check. Can I use it to fix fuel or morale? No. No, not unless the card specifically states it adds to it. No. Alright. Trying to get to. Yeah, W, press start check. That my yeah. turn. No, nope. this is your this is the end of the turn at this point. Um What are we doing? I'm I'm gonna let this pass, Agan. Well Agan slash Debbie. I don't think it's worth cards, this one. Yeah. We're not so low on. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry? Uh, but, uh, yeah, it's, I don't think it can do anything. We're losing a population. The population is our highest resource. I'm going to accept that and see if asylum players want to interfere with that. But I think that's fine. Yeah, we take a freebie. So minus one population. My hug and does. Well, unless of course we get extremely lucky on this. Yeah, Never there's know. two five. Nope. <laughs> no, not quite. Oh, well, there's always a chance. <laughs> Five population. And base are space, which you've already done. Okay, my move. Interesting. Executive order. Egan, take two. Uh, mo take two moves. All right. All right. I Wait, uh, you, sorry, you uh, you should not have drawn as much as you did because you only draw one skill card because you're in the sick bay. You're absolutely right. Unfortunately, I've messed that up slightly, but it's... know which one you drew first. No, no, it, it drew them in the order, so I know what that is. Was the executive cool. action one of the ones you drew? Yeah, but I have, an, really I have another executive action, so it's fine. Okay, I'm still perfect. Doing that. Cool. Yep. Oh, so you might. What? Could you still move out of the sick bay and then give me the order? Yeah, yeah of he, course. You I could can absolutely do that. move, and I'm going to be moving to FTL control. Control, I think. Yeah. No, actually, no, I'm going to be to weapons control. Um, okay. But, yeah. Okay, now I can get out of the brig. Yep, you can in fact get out of the brig. So Destiny start check for check one. And we get to see what they do before we decide whether we want to commit to this. So off we go. Hey, bird. And how much communication are they going to give to each other about how to interfere with this one? Do, 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 do. Chip, you okay? Yeah. Oh, sorry. I forgot. That's fine. I we're voting. Uh, is this we're voting to get Egan out of the brig. Yeah, I will. That would be an interesting thing if I wanted him out of the brig, huh? It would be interesting. Yeah. Let's see if you do. Um, put one in. But the unidentified ship thing. All right. Oh, they, put, they put two cards in. We have four currently in there. Um, Egan, this is I to get have, Aiden out of the Egan, break. I so. have a reasonably high number. Mm -hmm. Purple and red. Which is by itself. Purple and in yellow. Red. Ignoring all of the cards, it would nearly succeed by itself. That's, uh -huh. that's the cards I have available. So it's whether we want to go now or we want to hold off a turn. Because they're assuming a second one's coming. I think we hold off. Debbie, how good a card did you put in? Put one in, but it's a good one. Oh. Well, should we try and bluff it? Well, let's go. Let's go. Let's not mess around. If they've, um, they un they under hedge because they knew a second one was coming. That's my theory on this. If this doesn't work, then fine. We gave it a good try. Oh, what do we need? One yellow. Uh, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So it's ten versus one, two, three, six, seven, eight. So it's two. So I think that's a fail. Yeah, man, unfortunately screwed us up a bit. Although. 
Red Egan, how many cards did you add in again? Two. Hey, Debbie. Do you know which Thanks two? to Miss... <laughs> Thanks for not realizing it was yellow and purple like we told you multiple times. Oh, it's red and purple. No, it's yellow and purple. It's... The... Oh, this is break. Oh. oh. Right. I asked if we were doing this, if we were doing the unidentified ship to, no, to vote on. Right. It's fine. All right, second to action from Egan. I'm gonna get out of the break. <laughs> I gave a good card to the cause, and it wasn't yeah. worth anything. I also um, rises cut out again, so I have to wait for him to get back. Give a good card. It was a five. I have, you you can't put your cards in too. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah. Rises back. Come back. All right. Trying to get out of the break. We're going again. Yes. Yellow and purple. Um, I think I will throw two cards in this one. We're voting again. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, it's it's I get my card back. <laughs> no, you've used them, so yeah, I have to I'll go off one from time. Now. Why are we voting twice? Because I gave because Aiden two actions to try and force it and one of the two. And it looks like I we mean, could do it on the first one. I mean, I we are basically... I mean, we did, we just made him waste cards, so... <laughs> oh, look, yeah. entirely negative. But hey, we got some things out of, the bar out of their hands. All right. And too bad Destiny cards, I suppose. All right. Um, Egan? It's your oh, shadow, yeah. Christus. Oh, yeah. Wait, wait, Christus card for you. Fair yeah. enough. Um, President chooses. Oh, God. Oh, oh that's wonderful. Well, I believe I will choose minus two food. Fair enough. Um, Raiders activate. So one attack on this one and the other five, I think. They move towards civilians, but they move clockwise, so they still go into that area. Um, so one of the silent players want to roll for that? Oh, I'll say yeah, two more. Yeah. What are we rolling? Here, you can roll talent. Uh, you're rolling to damage a viper, five to seven to damage right. it, eight to destroy it. Yeah. Talent yeah, should I'm roll, because like I'm, yeah, I'm not a Cylon. So that's that's my roll, I don't think. There we go. Miss. No. Two. Okay, so nothing happens. I'm a politician, I can't shoot. <laughs> well, you're not <laughs> a politician, you're a robot. <laughs> I'm a robot politician. <laughs> Why didn't you let me roll? Because you didn't say because anything. You're not officially a full right, right. Cylon. Anyway. You're not a Cylon. Yeah, we don't know who you are, who, what your motives are. We can't let you roll. Egan's turn. I can draw, right? You can draw. You need to draw. I'm right. going to get out of the break. Of course you are. Attempt free. This is what. Secret attempt free. <laughs> well, I mean, he's got Just... nothing else to do. <laughs> yep. All right. I will pass. See, this is ultimately what I was aiming for. I was actually planning for the third one to be the successful one, but it looks as if we Thank could have got the second. <laughs> well, I'm going to go on the first. Okay, is... uh, for the record, you do get a jump prep for the last crisis. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we do, but it's fine. Uh, Which one are we? So we're still on the brig. This is our third brig attempt in a row. Politics and um, ta uh, tactics. Yeah, and you say it's fine, like the jump prep isn't the only thing that you have left to potentially win. <laughs> I mean, it's pretty much it, yeah. But, you know... <laughs> I say it's fine, especially as we can get Egan out of jail here. <laughs> only one. You can only put only one. Only one, yeah, because you're in jail. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah. Sorry. It's okay. You'll just have to t t take that. Well, right, Egan, oh, you I was going to say Egan tells us what card it is before he does that, but fine. Yeah. Well, it's fine. Egan, which one is your is the one you uh the lowest one you yeah, added? This one. Okay. Cool. Can I return it to me? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Just put it in your hand. Yellow, purple. Make it uh, one. Still a fail. <laughs> Yeah, it's fine. No crisis. Yes. Yeah. There you go. All right, my turn. Um, you know, we could I'm... probably just hammer them with the Cylon fleet at this point. Probably. Oh, we're actually much more pleasant in mind. Um, is I mean, it better just... for me to 
stay admiral president, though? Oh, yes, I think so. Yeah. I mean, you're totally human. We all know that. Yeah, I mean, sorry, is it better? No, I don't know why I, I'm trying to this, At this point, you might as well get into, what's it, into the gun room. I mean... The civilian ships. Can I do that? Well, I think, you, you yeah. find it technically have an option for something on one. Uh, honestly, you'd be better off just getting a Caprica and just winning the game. Well, that'll give someone else the... Uh... Yeah, that'll Probably make you, someone else Admiral have, and have President. A, true, but you have a super crisis coming before then. You have Rise's turn. You have Talon's turn. None of us have any cards in hand that are worth a damn, so you might as well be going for the win here. You, you also, you'll get a free crisis this turn, but you won't lose it if you go to Caprica. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to stay the Admiral I mean, President. Just, yeah. I mean, you're totally human. I believe you. I, I mean, mean, you can also, go to... I think if I become can... a Cylon, I will reduce the morale by one, so that could help. Well, yeah, sorry, then you, you have, have a hard time with morale anyway. I can guarantee you that. All right, well, then I'm going to stay the President King, and I'm going to do the quorum action again. He's going to stay the President King. If you could increase Mal, that would be lovely. <laughs> I, I don't think I can do that. Actually, I really can't. Otherwise, I might consider it for you. Um, all right, so I will... You either, Rise. <laughs> I'll consult the Oracle. Fair enough. Uh, I don't care about looking at the bottom card. I just want to do the Destiny deck. In fact, I'll look at the bottom card of the Destiny deck before doing this Destiny deck thing. Yep, fair enough. And then just or you could just <laughs> look at the bottom card of the Crisis deck. It's fine, he wants to remove Destiny, but uh, although he doesn't... Rise wants me to see what card he had to discard that he's really sad about. That's fine. Yes. We can find um, out later. Okay. I, could, I just remove two cards from the deck, basically? Yeah, yep. you do. Discard two of them. What colors do you need to get out of the brig? Yellow and purple. Yeah, so I just remove the yellows. Okay, so we'll discard this. I mean, I, you'll win the game before I even get that there. one. And we'll discard this one. Oh, just the two high ones. Fair enough. Fair enough, yeah. <sighs> Alright. Uh, and then a crisis. Food shortage. I will choose minus two food. All right, game over. Yeah. Uh, I just want to show you what I had coming up on my turn. We had an unbelievable amount of minus. Your morale would have been sunk too. Oh my god. Mm, I mean, that's a bit of a tricky decision, but ultimately it doesn't really matter at that point. I think I'd probably go with the other one though. Just for increases civilian ships, especially as we're low on stuff. Oh, we. I mean, I was trying to get the vapors destroyed so I could help you. No, I don't believe that at all. In the, I don't believe that in the slightest. But, um, <laughs> sure anyway, the for, for, yeah, for, the, your... for the purpose of the game, I was not a Cylon. Yeah, what were your motives? Yeah, I was a Cylon. I was a Cylon. I since completed since these two. There's, no, there's no mystery. Where were you a Cylon until from? I was a Cylon from the beginning. Same here. And oh, really? Turn, I was executed. <laughs> oh, my. You, Talon, and Black So you, need, you needed an extra Cylon allegiance somewhere. <laughs> I see, okay. Oh wait, so did you do it? Did you succeed? No. No, he didn't. He didn't succeed. He actually lost. This is what the comes of trying to help us. Game is over and the morale is five or less. Nope. So wait, so your Cylon ones were... And how many did My you have Cylons to have were these two, which I needed high resources. Oh, I see. Yeah, we really just like destroyed all the resources like equally over the course of the game. Population was the only high one. He succeeded that one, I think. Yep. So the only th so you do that so you got the subjects for study one and that's all you got and that's not enough. I got pressure the leaders, but yeah. Well, oh right. So you have a human one and a Cylon one revealed, and you needed two Cylon ones revealed. Yeah, to, to win. No more than one unrevealed. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Close. <laughs> May I have Good job, you talent? Sorry. Yeah, yeah. You, 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 you've been in the break for too long. You can flip out. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Dang. Yeah, that pushing, giving me the presidency did not work out well. I mean, it was no. fine. U ultimately, I, I, I think we, even if we'd have got Aegon out, it wouldn't have made that much difference. But I, thought, I think it would be three attempts, two of which, I, one of which I was keeping Sidden because that was going to happen. I'd have managed. It was just because of that first check and the fact that you put basically no cards in and I had six. So I figured it was worth a shot and then just they'd be putting the wrong cards, screwed us up. Oh well.
it, it wouldn't have mattered that it, much. It wouldn't have mattered because I think I think we were doomed yeah, anyway, yeah. but it would have given us an extra turn to try things. Yep. Yeah. Oh well. Put my history card into the presidential vote. Good luck, Miko. Cheers to 